收到啦。咩啊？攞多钱？搞错，佢带住咁大把刀嘅。明白。正话话，目标喺南边嗰边嚟啊。嗯，清楚。OK， 各单位准备，我睇实佢。<笑>你捉个威声先好啊。He's early. I'm a fucking blind. Relax, old boy. We're on the same side, remember? Do you want to get you in? Hey, you move on. Yeah, you got the money. Hey, the phone is on. What? There's a police officer. He's behind you. Find someone to hold him. It's possible. We're far away from here. Son, don't go around. Look, I can get you three, four keys a week if you want. Hmm. How do you? What? My shit's not good enough for you? Why? Don't pass a mess here. Where are you going? Hold on. Wait. Come, come, my friend. Just are you crazy? No, don't. Maybe we can sort something out, huh? You're crazy. You know who I'm from? Stop, Bogey. Don't let him get away. Get out of here. What's up, Owen? Fucking hell! Don't do it, man! Don't do it! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! No, what? What's the nuts? You see anyone? I think they're after Wu. Crazy fuck! Shit! Run! Stay with me! When did you get back? Well, wait, man, you look like shit. Hey, fuck you. <laughs> you know, 15 years to do that. You know, we're not kids anymore. Whatever, man. Ask anyone. Jackie Ma still looks good. Jackie Ma is still the same old. But good to see you. So what the fuck? They finally deport your ass from the United States? No, it was mutual. Time I came home anyway. Yeah, lock up. Home sweet home. So what'd they get you on? Nothing that'll stick. Ha! <laughs> well, don't let them pin any extra shit on you. Fuckers will try, let me tell you. Once they hear you're from Old Prosperity, happens all the time. Hey, so you still in touch with any of the guys from there? A few, you know. People kind of go their separate ways, but... You remember Winston? He's moved all the way up to Red Pole in the sun on ye. I've got a couple of things going with him right now, matter of fact. Huh. Red Pole in the sun on ye. Shit, Dog Guys always said he'd be running that neighborhood. Oh, Dog Guys is a red pole too. And still a total poke guy. He was the one who got Winston in. 
they were pretty tight back then, but now... Hey, wasn't Dog Eyes hanging with your sister? Yeah, it was a long time ago. Hey, remember when we were kids and you stabbed Dog Eyes with a pen? You totally saved my ass that day. Oh man, I gotta tell Winston that story. He'll fucking love it! Man, way fucking Shen in the flesh. I can't believe it. Check him off! Looks like I'm out of here. Hey, Jackie. So look, if you and uh, Winston ever need help with any of that shit you got going on with him. Of course, man. Look me up when you get out. You'll just be like old times. It seems that the evidence against you has failed to appear. How do you explain that? You must be a very dangerous man, Wei Shen. That is exactly what we want people to think. I trust that my men weren't too rough on you, officer. You might ask them the same question, sir. Those guys are out of shape. It paid off, though. I made contact with Jackie Ma. I'm in. Good work. Use him to get close to Winston Chu. Do whatever it takes. Raymond here will be your handler. You'll report everything through him. Our intel suggests that Winston is looking for muscle. You need to find a way to make him trust you. I've done this before. Not in Hong Kong. American gangs, even Asian ones, don't compare to the triads here. The Sun on Yi is the most powerful Look, gang- Look, Raymond. Your, your name is Raymond, right? Yes. I grew up with these guys. I know who they are, what they are. All the intel reports in the world won't give you that. We want the Red Poles. The lieutenants like Winston, all of them. And most of all, the dragon head. Candidly, Wei, previous attempts to get close to him haven't panned out. We don't have much to go on. That's why you're here. I'm hoping that you can bring something more to our investigation. I understand, sir. Look, the sooner I'm on the street, the sooner I can start. Raymond will be in touch. Owen oh, Wei! Good luck out there. Respectfully, sir, are you sure about him? He'll be under extreme stress maybe for a very long time. Now, I'm not sure he has the discipline to hold up. According to the file, he has a history of, of extreme behavior. Yes, and an astonishing number of convictions. He obviously blames the Trias for what happened to his family. It could turn into a vendetta. Raymond, Wei Shen is perfect for this job. Wei Shen? Man, this is going to be great. Yeah, thanks again, Jackie. Yeah, I appreciate the intro. No problem, man. By the way, you know I tried looking you up a few years back, but I couldn't find shit. Do they have internet in America? <laughs> I think they're getting it next year. I guess you were in prison or something. Come on, let's get out of here. Still getting used to being back, huh? Yeah. So Winston's a red pole now? All this territory is Winston's. But Dog Eyes is pushing in. If they're both red poles, shouldn't they be on the same side? Should be. Dog Eyes always was an asshole. Turns out, he's a greedy asshole too. One thing, when we get to Winston's, let me do the introductions. They're really distrustful of new faces right now. It's wild the paranoia. Sun on Yi had a rat. From what I hear, they didn't let him have a quick death. They made it real slow and painful. Hey, Jiu Mei, how are you, baby? Jackie, you know my parents don't want you to talk to me. Your parents don't even know me. Once we get to know each other, they'll love me. Leave him alone. I'm gonna call the cops. Leave him alone. I'm gonna call the cops. 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 Get 
kidding me? <laughs> yeah, all right. Come the fuck on. Come and get me! I look nasty. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Bunch of fucking assholes. So, everything's cool? Well, you're welcome anyway. Come on, Jackie. Let's go see Winston. Here we are. Winston's mom owns the restaurant. Oh! Where the fuck do you think you're going? Relax, man. This is Wei. Wei Shen. I told you about him, remember? Fuck. We can't keep track of your bullshit friends, Jackie. No outsider. He's not an outsider. He's from old prosperity. Like us. Ho Chi all day, Jama. Wei's old school, you know? I grew up with the guy. Old prosperity, huh? I've been on vacation. You know, Jackie said you were looking for people. Oh, Jackie, eh? No, 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 no. You should have seen it, Winston. Wade just beat up like 10 of Dog Eyes guys in the market by himself. Hi, man. Uh, they attacked us. Seems to me you could use some better help. Winston, I don't like this cocky little fucker. Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. <laughs> Dang Yatsung, I do remember you. You had a, a sister, right, Hamaya? Yeah, Mimi. Mimi, Mimi Shen. I remember her. Hung out with dog eyes. <laughs> no offense. Dang I so to Where is she now? She's dead. Ah. Sorry. Oh, you see her. So, ten guys, huh? You feel us? They're just crazy. Try capable. Uh -huh. We'll see. Conroy, you know that problem we got in the market? Why don't you take Way with you? Hey, Jackie, hang back a second. I want to hear more about your friend. <laughs> All right. You want to be a tough guy? Let's see if you can handle yourself. Dude, see what he's got. Great. That's all I fucking need. You like that? Hello, boys. Hey, let it go, my son. Yeah, boss, we were just leaving. Tell her, huh? <laughs> and it was just getting interesting, too. Winston, my old friend, so good to see you. How's your family, huh? What do you want, dog eyes? Oh, Winston, wait, wait, wait. Brother, I just came to talk to you, man. For old time's sake. Let's work something out here, okay? We can share the night market, huh? We're both Song Ong Yi, both grown men. We shouldn't be fighting like children. <laughs> hey, who's the new blood? It's Wei. You remember Mimi Shen? Back when you first started getting girls with Big Smiley. Oh, Mimi. Oh, yeah. First girl ever sucked my cock. <laughs> yeah, so what? Ways of brother. And I was the first guy who ever stabbed you. You remember me now? Whoa, 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 wait. What the fuck, man? Seriously, Way? I apologize. 
I'm really sorry. Your sister blew me. <laughs> the night market is mine, dog eyes. You got Siwa in the warehouse. That was the deal. So stay the fuck out. Hey, tell your sister give me a call, huh? I wouldn't mind giving her a mouthful. <laughs> Changed. Yeah, he has. He used to be my friend. Jackie, you two go to the night market. You make sure people understand that I'm in control, not dog eyes. Got it? Got it, boss. Moment I. And you fuck up anybody who tries to get in your way. I want to send a fucking message. This will be easy. No problem. You just have to be strong. That's what people expect. So you mentioned your sister back there. Maybe? Yeah, she, o she od years ago now. I mean, after we moved to the States, she tried to kick that shit, but... That sucks! She was, you know, really alive. My mother thought maybe a new city, a new country, but the hooks weren't deep. And once you start on that shit, it's hard to stop. For anybody. Yeah, once well, she started. Oh, man? And it was dog eyes that got her into it? Yep. Fucking dog eyes. Uh, you gonna tell Winston? No. You? Shit, Wade. Winston's the boss. But when we were kids, you were the only person who was nice to me. You were my best friend, man. That means more than a boss, you know? Hey! You want food? Joey Kwan sells pirate DVDs. Let's start with me. Let me dress you. Hey, little brother. We work for Winston. I understand. How can I help? Winston runs this place, and if you don't want trouble, you pay him. Period. Of course. No problem. I got special deals. Need anything? Just come ask. Hey, come on in. I got special deal for you. No, this is going to piss Dog Guys off. At some point, Winston and Dog Guys are going to clash, man. Over here. This is basically. Hey, you want to do the talking? We're collecting for Winston. Winston? Dog Eyes said he's in charge here. We're here to clarify. What? You want to be the guy we use to clear up the confusion? I'm not afraid, you guys. Don't be a tough guy. I'm glad I can make you see reason. Take the money. Doc, I won't be happy. Dude, I think, I think you killed him. I'll be fine. We'll just have to drink you a straw for a while. Over here. I think this guy's with dog eyes. You work for Winston. We need to discuss business. Winston? I don't have any business with Winston. Everyone has business with Winston. You're gonna pay up, you understand? Go tell Winston to stick a back toy up his ass. Hey, fellas! You troops are moving in on your tail. Come on, guys! Stick his ass! From me. I, I think we're almost done, but let's check over there. A man who hey, look at that guy. He's beating up that old man. That ain't gonna fly in our turf. Hello? Who's I go? You're not a fuck with anyone under our protection. Whoa! 
Little dog guys, this market belongs to us. Why was he beating you? He was demanding 20 times the normal payment. Maybe as a drug addict or something. For a small fee, Winston will make sure you don't have trouble with gangsters. That sounds very reasonable. Over here, people need to know you're one of us. We got an image to maintain, only the best brands. People gotta know you're successful. The clothes make the man, huh? Definitely. It's all about the clothes, man. You know how it is. People judge you by how you look. Oh, that was awesome, man. All this teen, teen, teen. It's like you were born to do this. Hey, Jackie! What you gonna tell her what's going on? Just keeping an eye on things. Yeah? What'd you see? I tell you what I didn't see. Nothing to be impressed about. I'm watching you, new guy. You fuck up? What? We're gonna throw down? What kind of grade school shit is this, huh? I work my ass off all day, so fuck off and grow up. Jackie! You're coming with me. We got something to take care of. And you! Don't fuck with me. Can you do me a favor? Oh, yeah. What is it? Mrs. Chu sent over some lunch, but I haven't paid yet. Can you take this back to the restaurant? All right. You might want to hurry. I heard dog guys are sending reinforcements. You should probably be gone before they get here. I came straight to you. Didn't want to start anything major but without you knowing, you know? So get this. A couple years ago, this guy Ming came to me and asked me to look out for him while he did business. Special K mostly, but other stuff too. I thought, why not? I'd take a nice little cut for my boys, no problem. But this week, I sent Jackie here to pick up the envelope and he tells my boy to fuck off. Apparently, he's friends with dog eyes now, so we can all go fuck ourselves. You want me to make an example out of dog eyes? That home, Garton, is gonna get what's coming in. Right now, I need someone to take care of me. I'm looking for me. You know where he's at? Yeah, he just passed the food stand around the corner. Don't you let me dress you? You want good clothes? You make it up for me tonight, and we got a deal. Huh? What are you going to do? Me! I got a message oh, for you! Stop! You didn't pay Winston, asshole! Fuck you! Out of my way! Kill you! Stop, nigga, both guys! 
guys are gonna kill you. Fuck dog guys. <laughs> Winston owns this area. You fuck with us, and you'll regret it. Okay, okay. But please, make sure dog guys doesn't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Hey, hey, watch it. Oi, Shane. I'm Inspector Tang. You have quite a rap sheet here. Multiple arrests in San Francisco, alleged ties to organized crime, and now you're here enforcing for the sun on Yi. You know, you don't have to throw your life away like this. <laughs> Your concern's really moving. Yeah, I appreciate that. I'm suddenly realizing I should have never dropped out of art school. I could have made it. I could have been a real somebody. Thank you for showing me the light, officer. I want to give you a chance, Shen, but you have to work with me. Then maybe I can cut you a deal. Oh, Superintendent, I'm in the middle of an interrogation. Inspector, there's been a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding, sir? As your superior officer, I'm instructing you to release this man. But, sir, I have it on record that he's son on Yi. I understand that. I can't simply just cut him loose. I mean, you're asking me to release a criminal with known connections to the triad. And not only is it against well, protocol... for God's sake, Tang, he's one of us. What? Jesus, Pendrew, let me get the door. There are a few badges outside who didn't hear you. It's all right, Wei. We can trust her. Trust her? I just met her. Congratulations, Tang, so now you know. Maybe now we can make sure that we're helping Wei, not making his job harder than it already is, hmm? Yeah, it doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. No, no, you don't. Now see yourself out. Permission to speak freely. Denied. You need to be more careful, Wei. Much more careful. I can't bail you out like this again. Sir, I, I don't want to hear it. Just be careful. American gangs and Asian ones don't compare to the triads. I don't like this cocky little fucker. You need to be more careful, Way. Much more careful. Wait, you okay, man? You look like someone took a shit on your face. <laughs> Jackie, I'm, you know, I'm just a little frustrated, stuck being Winston's errand boy. You know, I was making serious bank back in the States. Come on, we're just paying our dues. Winston's a loyal guy. He'll hook us up when the time's right. You can't always wait for the world to hand you what you want. Sometimes you got to just take it. Totally, man. It's time to take a little initiative. We got to prove ourselves to Winston and the son on ye, or we'll never move up. Is there anything? going down in the next few days. Shit, yeah, there is. Dog Eyes has a big shipment of stolen goods coming in. Well, it's good for Dog Eyes, but that might be too much or too fast. The last thing I need right now is taking a sticky red pole up my it's ass. It's not like that. It's a small deal. Word is there's only a few low-level London. You're looking after it. We boost that shit and give Winston a nice fat cut, he's going to be mad impressed. No way he doesn't promote us after that. You'd have to be certain it couldn't be traced back to Winston. Or us. Sure, of course. They're never gonna know it was us. Unless we get caught. Well, we won't unless you fuck it up. Come on, get in. Time to move up in the world. <laughs> Where'd you get the van? My uncle's a chop shop around the corner. Call it a pre-stolen ride. I'm thinking I'm gonna get a steady girlfriend. Oh, yeah? What do you think it's you, May? You're not worried that she doesn't want to talk to you? Hell no. If I let that stop me, I'd never ask anybody out. What about you? You ever think of finding somebody? A relationship. Yeah, it wouldn't really work with my life right now. Sure it could. Look at me. <laughs> You're one of a kind, Jackie. What's all the crap in the back? The haul for my last score, baby. Haul? Oh, what haul? Oh, shit! Put on his mask. Can't let Dog Eyes boys know it was us. There should only be a few guards. Keep the engine running. Later, man. 
Don't you know each other? There's more of them. That was our big boost? A shipment of cheap watches? What? What do you mean cheap? Jackie, he's a fake as fuck. Holy shit, Tylo, and the cops drive. Wait, drive. That's it. Yeah, they're gone. We're clear, man. No wonder there's so many criminals in this town. Those cops suck. So where's this guy we're meeting? Don't worry. I'll take you from here. You sure you don't want me to stick around? Oh, man, I got it under control. So no, uh... All right, your deal. Hey, wait. You did good out there. Here. Take this watch. You earned it. Great. I finally hit the big time. My man, away! You done good. You restored order to the night market. Well, he took a chance on me, Winston. I wanted to make sure it paid off. You got the right attitude. That's gonna pay off for you. You'll see. You know anything about the minibus racket? Well, same as everyone. If you want to drive a good route, you pay the toll. That's right. You know the pickup on Marble Drive? The most profitable route in the whole fucking city. From now on, it's yours. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it, Winston. <laughs> Dog eyes, well. Right now it's his route. But you know how to deal with it, huh? It'll be my fucking pleasure. I gotta take this. Take a few of the guys with you to back you up. Let's go. What's going on? We're going on offense. Taking over Marlboro Drive. One man per stop. Anybody gives you shit? Fuck them up. Smack them around. No killing. What, afraid of little blood? Dog eyes his son on ye. We're taking the route. Not declaring war. You can ask. It's fine by me. I'll take this one. Good job. Yeah, kick his ass. Wait, hold on, gun. How come we're going after Dark Eyes? Shouldn't we be fighting 18K? Dark Guy came after us? This is payback. Plain and simple. What if Dark Eyes complains to Big Smile Lee? What if he sends Mr. Tall after us? Look, dude. Dark Eyes might work for Lee, but Winston S is direct to Uncle Cole. Nobody going to fuck with the chairman. Nobody. Hey, 
you haven't paid. If you stop, we'll beat you. This is our stop now. Yeah! <laughs> I'll give you that. Thanks. Yeah, we have another guy with us a while back. He was good with his fist too. Came out of nowhere. Good story. Didn't talk much. You remind me of him. A lot. Turned out he was a cop. That's why he couldn't kill anyone, see? So now we know how to spot a rat. You talk a lot, you know that? You know what they do to traitors, right? When Tong is done with them, he buries them alive. Six feet under. Nobody coming for you. Hey, fuck you, Conroy. I still think about that poor fucker sometimes. Let's go. No, 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 you stay here. I'll deal with this. Watch how a real man does it. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Hey, you. You want this ride, you gotta pay for it. Are you stoned? I already paid, though, guys. Belongs to Winston now. Winston? Pull over and I'll tell you about it. You're wasting my time. How about I break your legs and see how you drive then, huh? I still drive better than you. I finished my road before you finish making your notes. There must be recruiting dumbass peasants from across the border. You never seen a car before? Go back to your mule before you get hurt. <laughs> you gonna do comedy from your hospital bed, pal? Everybody laugh, but you want the street boys. You mess with me and dog eyes? Hey, listen, this route is mine. You wanna drive a dog eyes route? Move to one he actually owns. I don't pay twice for the same road. <laughs> you know what? You're taking your life in your own hands. You're gonna pay, funny guy. I don't pay you. I drive my route. You're gonna regret this. Okay, okay, I'm going. Get out of here, I'm taking your passengers. Okay, okay. There's a slight problem with your bus, so we're doing a change. Don't worry, people. After a quick change of drivers, we're on our way. What are you doing here? I'm sure you and Penju have a lot of top secret backdoor business to attend to. Look, I'm sorry about how I acted in there. You know, just playing the part. I'm already out there on the streets. I hear things like this ketamine racket. I'll see what I can dig up. How's that for an olive branch? You're serious? Just like that? Look, I'll help where I can. <laughs> what? I'm just a little shocked. I'm just used to Penju's people being more like him. I just think we'd be better off helping each other. Come on, what do you say? I could really use the help if you're willing to give in. Well, all right. Everything you need? No, man. I haven't been back to Popstar since I left Dog Eyes. 
I'm not sure how he's gonna take it. Want me to talk to him? Yeah, yeah. I'm just about out. So grab my next shipment and make sure everything is cool. Hey, is Pops are around? What when a nice looking boy like you wants with my boyfriend? You pop star? Who's asking? Look, I work for Winston. Dirty Ming's operating in our territory. I want to make sure he's supplied. Sure, I'll fix him up. But... But what? I gotta get paid. In advance. I'll make it easy for you. A couple of deadbeat junkies owe me money. Guys used to deal for me before they became their own best customer. Collect what they owe me, and I'll hook your man up. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Who the fuck is this? He's okay. One of Winston's guys. Yeah? Guess son on you won't pick on anyone these days. Who's that? Feng Shen. Best shit in Hong Kong. You got my money? Got your money. Here's your package. Tell Ming to stick with girls over 14 this time. It's the cops. Stay cool. Hey, you two! Come over here! Let's go! Stop! Uh, 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 rest. Inspector Tang? What have you found? I got enough to bust Popstar, but I also met a supplier, a guy named Fang Shen. Find out where he hangs out, and I'll see if I can get something on him. I'll get back to you. Oh, Ellie, though, Ma. You got the stuff, right? Don't worry, I got your stuff right here. Now I can start making money again.
Inspector Tang, this is Wei. Fang Shan is down. Popstar will have to reach out to another supplier. I'm thinking we bag them both at once. I agree. Now, if I'm gonna get close to him, I'm gonna need a good disguise. Can you have your people send something over? All right. Keep me informed. Got it. Uh, excuse me. Do you speak English? I like to think so. Not enough to get by anyways. You? Yeah, I... Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I speak English. I kind of guess. What can I do for you? I'm looking for this place. Old Temple Academy. I thought it was around here. It's supposed to be a kung fu school, but I'm totally lost. <laughs> I have no sense of direction. Yeah, I, I think I know where it is. I mean, it's not too far. I, I can give you a ride. <laughs> I mean, it'll be easier than explaining where it is. Uh, okay, yeah, that, that'd that be really great. My name's Amanda, by the way, or Amy. Either one is fine. Oh, well, nice to meet you, Amy. I'm Wei. <laughs> So what brings you to Hong Kong? Are you thinking of becoming Chinese? <laughs> no, no, I, uh, I just finished college and I'm doing a bit of traveling. You know, figuring out what to do with my life, that sort of thing. How's that going? Well, I've only been traveling for a few weeks, so no real progress on the life front. Yet. But I'm checking out Hong Kong for a while. So this is the Bam Bam Club. Back home I saw a restaurant that looked a little bit like this. <laughs> Don't let the locals hear you say that. But I'm checking out Hong Kong for a while. What about you? You got it all figured out? I wouldn't say that. I, mean, I got a few family issues I'm working on clearing up. Maybe once that's dealt with, I'll get on to figuring out life. Oh yeah? You got any pointers? Well, the trick to Hong Kong is learning to live by ancient Chinese wisdom. Look both ways before crossing the street. Always buckle your seatbelt and only apply makeup at red lights. Don't text and drive, you know, that kind of thing. Words to live by. Wow. This is a pretty cool place for a kung fu school. Unfortunately, the school isn't in the temple. Well, not that temple, anyway. Didn't they use this temple as a backdrop for, what was it, Fists of Carnage? <laughs> no, it was used in the grandfathers of the Shaolin Fist. Isn't this school supposed to be in a temple? Can I help you? Yeah, I'd like to sign up for some kung fu classes. I read about your school in my guidebook. Ah, uh, your guidebook. Yeah, it said you teach a style with a long lineage, but in spite of all that, it's still considered very effective. You want to take classes, okay. And you, did you also read about this place in some book? Well, I... Wait. Uh... I know you. Yes, Sifu Kwa. I used to be your student. I'm Wei, Wei Shen. Ah, yes. The one who went to America. So you brought this girl back with you. Uh... Your skill level with girls, very good. Now time to assess your skill level in Kung Fu. Try to steer them in the right direction, especially the younger ones. But they all want to be Song Ong Yi. Now, now I just train them in the ways of my art. Try to teach them compassion and discretion, and pray for the best. See, for I don't think there's much more you can do. Oh, Jade Rat. The Song Dynasty, right? Very good. The Song Dynasty? That's like a thousand years old or something. That's real? Part of a set of twelve. One for each animal of the Chinese calendar. Sifu, 
You used to have the whole set. What happened to the others? Stolen by a former student, corrupted by the triads. I'm so sorry to hear that, Sifu. So was I. Hmm. This collection meant a lot to me. But sometimes you just have to let things go. I should close up. It was good to see you again, Wei. And your lovely fiance. What? <laughs> okay, uh, that was fun. What do you want to do now? Oh, I need to get home. But uh, I will definitely call you later. <sighs> yeah, hello? Amanda, it's Wei. You doing anything later? Way! Hi! I was going to go see Magistrate Park. You wanna come along? Yeah, cool. See you in a bit. Meet me at Victoria Peak. Yeah, that'd be fun. See you, Way. Way! Hi! Hey, Amanda. You look frustrated. What's going on? It's closed. Why is it closed? The public is only allowed in on the weekends. Oh, this sucks. I wanted some pictures for my blog. Hmm. Well, let me see what I can do. You know how I was talking about writing a book? Yeah? With your photos, right? Yeah. I decided to do it on all those cool little shrines all over town. Oh! Oh! Can you take a picture here? That looks good, thanks. <laughs> you know, I have to say, that dress looks really good on you. Well... You know, this guy bought it for me. The guy bought you that dress, huh? Tell me about it. Well, he's pretty cocky. He's a bit of a jerk. But he's also kind of cute. And what does the guy think about you? I don't know. I hope he likes me. Well, I don't know about the guy, but I think you're pretty cute. You think you can let me and my friend in? No, I told you he's closed. Look, I'll make it worth your while. Well, sir, it is time for my break. I think I'll go for a walk. You're so resourceful, Way. Hey, will you take some pictures for me? Please? Oh, over here. Oh, that's pretty. This is a good spot. Good composition. One more. Good photographer. Ah, no problem. My pleasure. That was great. Thank you so much. I can't believe you got us in here. That's ah, no problem. I mean, it was fun. Kind of, you know, nice playing tourist in your own town. Yeah, I can see that. Thanks again, though, for taking the time to, you know, do this. Yeah, it's okay. So, uh, was this like a, a date? Sounds good to me. What do you think? Definitely. I mean, uh, yeah. Yeah, that sounds great. Well, thank you for the date, then. So, hey, I have an idea. Oh, really? Tell me more. <laughs>
Finally. See the stuff. Popstar supplier? I got him. So did Popstar. Two shots in the chest. Damn. Shuts down the drug pipeline at least. And I'm giving you Popstar on a platter. I got the deal and the double cross on camera. Good work, Way. Thanks. With Popstar gone, Sun on Yi is down to only one supplier. The bottleneck will create a lot of tension inside the triad. Watch your back, Way. Popstar and his top lieutenants. Conspiracy, trafficking, possession, and murder. He'll get life. And we've seized what looks like an entire month's supply. Thanks, Way. 
We've done more to stop drugs coming into Hong Kong than half the narcotics squad combined. I found one of your statues. The snake. I am grateful. I must confess, I was surprised to see you back. I had hoped that you might have escaped Hong Kong. Escaped its influences. Its problems. We took them with us when we left. So coming back didn't change much. Are you ready to confront them now? Yes, I think so. Wait! Get over here now! What's going on, Winston? It's Benny, manager of Club Bam Bam, old friend of mine. Now he's working for Dog Eyes! That Ham Gatan is getting back at us for taking his minibus route. Look, I'll go talk to Benny, make him see reason. Yeah. Yeah, wait, you go do that. <laughs> Are you gonna let me in? What do you think you're doing? I got a message from Dog Eyes. You wanna tell him you sent me away? Dog Eyes? Oh, sorry, of course. Come on in, sir. We do get the respect to Sir Sewer. They want the drugs. But how would they get this drugs in the first place without us? Hey buddy, VIPs only. What's going on in there? This is one of the best karaoke rooms in the city. Nobody gets in without a hostess or the boss's approval. I'm sure we can work something out. Work something out with the hostess. Hey, what's your name? I'm Tiffany. Nice to meet you. I'm Wei. Wei Shen. You're a karaoke hostess, right? Can you get me into the VIP room? Sure. Just come with me. You have a bit of an accent. Are you from around here? Yeah, originally, but you know, I was in the States for a long time. Oh, that's so cool. I always wanted to go. So, uh, what's Benny like? Benny? You mean the manager? Yeah. Well, Benny's nice enough. He always makes sure you get paid on time. That's good. So, uh, who does he rely on for protection? Let's go sing. <laughs> Come on. Sing me a song. Wow, you're actually really good. Listen, you know, I like it down here, but back home, I'm used to a little more. Oh, hey, hey, who the fuck are you? I'm looking for Benny. Hey, Benny. Yeah. Some guy here wants to talk to you. Hey, hey, what can I do for you? I have a message from an old friend, Winston Chu. What, what, what Winston? Well, that, uh, this isn't such a good idea. I think you should leave. He wants you to know that Dog Eyes isn't your problem anymore. If he gives you any trouble, you let Winston know, and I'll take care of it, personally. You heard that, man. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Benny, I'm not gonna kill you. Okay. Just listen. Okay. What do you want? Just what I said. Winston wants to be your friend. And what about dark eyes? Not your problem. I hope you're right. For my sake. Can I go now? Of course you can, Benny. <laughs> you're late. Conroy's still watching me. He's got a real hard on. Is your cover compromised? Well, you haven't fished me out of the harbor yet. All right. How are you doing? How am I doing? <laughs> Fuck, Raymond, where do I start? There's a civil war brewing in the sun on Yi. Winston and Dog Eyes escalated practically every day. Don't you read my fucking reports? I mean, you personally. How are you doing? <laughs> Look, Raymond, I gotta get back. Your state of mind is important, Wade. It's important to me, it's important to how you do your job. Fuck you. I do my job just fine. Well, that's for me to decide. You mean Pendrew. Pendrew assigned me as your controller. And listen, Wei, Pendrew may not be concerned about you, but I am. I know you have a personal stake here, but this cannot be a vendetta. We're cops. There are rules. You're a cop. I'm an undercover cop. The rules are different. And you're fucking concerned about me? You are an officer of the law, Wei. Same as me. We are not the same. You understand? We done? Yeah, we're done. Hey, baby. Tiffany, it's Way. Oh, hi. How are you? I'm good. Listen, um, you busy later? Well, I'm working. Why? I was thinking of dropping by Bam Bam to see you. Oh, that'd be great. You want to sing karaoke? <laughs> well, you have to get a few drinks in me first, but, uh, maybe. I'll see you in a bit. You got it. Bye-bye. Hey, Tiffany. Oh, you're here. I've got everything set up. <laughs> There's no escaping karaoke here, is there? <laughs> you want to sing first? <laughs> is there anything you'd like me to sing? <laughs> no, thanks. Uh, maybe next time. Yeah. I should get going. Really? So soon? You don't want me to sit on your lap and sing for you? That's the kind of thing clients usually want. Well, when you put it like that. <laughs> Let's go sing. <laughs> you ready to go crazy? I'm a pro, so try to keep up. for you. You guys smell something? I do. Just a sexy glow shoe. You know what happens to rats, Way? Uh, yeah, I, I heard. Yeah, Conroy gave me all the details when he was helping me out on that mini- You so Santa! Who the fuck do you think you are, huh? You come in out of nowhere and suddenly our guys start to get arrested? He ran it out, pop star Winston. I know he did. Oh, you're gonna do it uh, right. This motherfucker right here is a snitch. Uh, is that right, Ming? You fucking rat. I sent you to pop star, but now he's in jail. Yeah? And who stands to gain the most from that? You're gonna take over pop star's whole ketamine racket now. No more scraps for you. You'll supply the whole city with drugs. You and Dog Eyes. Pop star is gone, but you're still dealing, aren't you? So who's supplying you? Are you guys actually listening to this asshole? He's a rat. He's a fucking rat. Take him to Hong Kong, young lad. Stop. You're still working for that bastard, aren't you? I'm out. Wait, 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 I swear. Oh, he's a dirty fucker, man. Oh, my God. My God.
You get in this business for yourself, you're bound to end up like little Lanta. I found one of your statues. Ah, oh, the dragon. Wonderful. I promised myself I wouldn't train members of the triads anymore. Not good for one's karma. What makes you think I'm in the triads? Don't lie to me. If there are things you can't reveal, don't. But never lie. <laughs> How do we talk about the things I can't reveal? You don't need to. I knew you well once. I don't believe people change that much. Right. <laughs> Appreciate your faith. Boy and can I help you with something? Yeah. Are you Ping? <laughs> no. There's no Ping. How about the owner then? I'm the owner. Just not Ping. <laughs> All right, not Ping. I'm picking up hardware for Orange Lotus. You know it? Orange Lotus? Sure. This is some pretty sophisticated stuff. Sure, you can handle it? I'll manage. My number's on the package. You need a hand getting slot X into socket Y? Give me a call. I got it. Oh shit. How'd the bus thing go? Good. We well, can fight, huh? Yeah. What? Nothing. Hey, don't try that shit. You got something to say, talk. I don't. We can't go on. It's too easy. This guy comes out of nowhere. Just look at all the rest of us. Thought I'd see if I could talk you into teaching me a few things. Okay, let's go. First thing is make sure the coast is clear. Better get rid of that cop somehow. Whatever. Uh... 
Excuse me, officer? Yes? What is it? Yeah, I, I saw what looked like a drug deal a couple minutes ago. Over there. Thanks for the tip, sir. I'll check it out. Drug deal, huh? Mchawa, I have to say though, the cops in this town are kind of dumb. All right. When I feel restless, I come out here and hotwire a camera, just for fun. Hotwire? Why not just hack it? I don't have the software to do that. <laughs> Let me show you how the pros do it. I'll keep an eye out if the police come back. I don't think I can sweet talk them like you did though. Going to tell me? Maybe I can find a way to bribe you later. Would you like some ice cream? So that was um <laughs> like pretty fun. I didn't know you were so into tech stuff. Yeah, I'm you know into all sorts of crazy shit. I bet. <laughs> you know, I still don't know your name. What what do you mean? Well, look at my address book. You're still just not ping to me. <laughs> That's cute. I like that. So you want to set me straight? Eventually. Most likely. All right. <laughs> I guess we'll see what it takes to get it out of you. Eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you how the pros do it. Yeah? You going to show me how to hack a camera? Of course. I found one of your statues. Oh, the dog. Excellent. I understand your sister passed. She was an addict. She couldn't kick it. It's not a very interesting story. I suppose, though in light of that, your chosen career is rather interesting. To me anyway, knowing who you are. You asked me once not to lie to you. And I think in return, you shouldn't ask me about my career. Fair enough. Inspector. Away. I'm glad you're here. What do you know about the underground racing circuit? Well, they drive fast, occasionally they crash into something. Yeah, and occasionally they end up killing each other. Hmm. Well, that's manslaughter at best. But these last couple of files don't feel like manslaughter to me. It's got more of a deliberate feel to it. You want me to check it out? Yeah. Get into the circuit and see what you can find out. All right. See you. Wei Shen, you up for a race? Yeah, sure. Long as you don't mind losing. for you, those Amars kept getting in the way. One in a million shot. You want a rematch? Yeah, sure. I'll take you. <laughs> you ready for the big time? Let me know. Everybody knows I'm the best driver in the city. Everyone. Oh, yeah? I'll take you down too, Hotshot. Just as soon as my car is fixed. Okay. 
No, I'm in big trouble. I really need your help, please. What's wrong? It's... It's this... A gun? Yes. Charlie made me carry it in my purse for him. He didn't want the cops to find it, so he made me take it. And now he's gone, and I don't know what to do with it. Charlie, he's one of Dog Eyes people, right? Yes, and you took over, right? So in a way, the gun is yours too. You'll take it, won't you? Sure, I'll take it. That's it? That's, uh, that's your big problem. Yes, thank you so much, Wei. I knew I was right to trust you. Don't worry, Tiffany, I'll take care of it. Thanks, Wei. You're the greatest. Hello? Raymond, I got something. What is it? Something for ballistics, a weapon belonging to one of Dog Eye's men. Do you know Charlie Pang? Wait, how did you get Charlie Pang's gun? Never mind. Can you use it? All right, meet me. I'm on my way. Would you like some ice cream? Andrew? What are you doing here? Where's Raymond? This is something I wanted to handle personally, Way. Do you have Charlie Pang's gun? Yeah. I'm sure you've noticed the guns are something of a rarity in Hong Kong. Not like in the States. This particular gun is quite important. So who's the dead guy? I was hoping you'd help me with that, actually. Officer Shen, take up a firing position. All right, listen. It's simple. We'll have to recreate the fight. You think you can bring me out? Whoa, oh, hang on. Let's just talk about this. Fuck you. Let's go. Damn it. You got a First, he was in cover behind the barricade. Get down behind that barrier. Good. I want you to put some bullets in a few things. All right, good. By now, the van must have appeared on the scene. Then he must have run through over there. Shooting at the guys over there. There was a shooter. Firing shots from the passenger window. But he couldn't get a clean shot, so he pulled forward. One more thing. He would have tried to get away, but Charlie disabled the car. Your weapon, officer. Good firing, Way. Pedro! What are you doing? I told you he wasn't important. Now he is. He's going to help us nail Charlie Pang. It's for the greater good, Way. You understand? I don't think I do, sir. Way, I know who you are. You're just like me. You do what must be done. Hmm. Local PD is on their way. You should go. Ew! Thank you, Sanghua! What the fuck's going on? Dog I shut up Winston's mother's restaurant tonight. Winston, I just heard. Your mother? She's, she's fine. But two of our people were killed, and a couple customers were wounded. The police are there now. Wait, wait, he went after your family? Hello? Everyone's outside. What choice? You always should fight. Listen up! We're hitting a switch up on the waterfront. All his trucks move to that place. It's how he makes his money. I want it burned to the ground. 
See who outruns the operation. Put that hump, Gurton, in the shadow grave. Hey, don't turn my gear. It's over. Winston, are you sure about this? Of course, I'm fucking sure. Look, what's the chairman gonna say when he finds his warehouse floating in the ocean? He's not gonna like it. But there's no way Dog Guys walks away from this. So burn the warehouse, but take Suha alive. Put him to work for you, and give the chairman a bigger cut than he was getting from Dog Eyes. Okay. Okay, okay, do it. Bring him alive. Right, boss. Get in. Dog Eyes gotta know he fucked with the wrong people. Yeah, no kidding. We're short a gun. You're good with your hands, Shen. Let's see what you can do without iron. Look, hold on. We shouldn't go in shooting anyone. Anyway. There'll be workers in there. And we need Su while alive. He's worth the fortune. Oh, we're going in shooting. This is Dog Guy's biggest money maker. They're not gonna give it up without a fight. But you want me unarmed? You're the new guy. Once you're inside, find your own gun. And use it. Believe me, you better have some bodies on you before the night is over. I want to see proof that you're not a cop. As far as I'm concerned, there's only one test that matters. So you want me to kill one of Dog Eyes' drug dealers to prove it? All right. It'll be my pleasure. All right, here's the plan. Go to the back door. I'll look around. You wait for my signal to attack. If I can. That was fucking crazy!
insult me? The car's crap! Let me fix my car up. Then I'll take you. Easy. Fine. It's your funeral. Second, huh? I still own it. Hey, you know this guy Wei Shin? Supposed to be Sen on Yi. Every time I turn around, that guy shows up. And usually the cops aren't far behind. Started racing the other day. Talk tough. You think he's a rat? Or on the cover. They had a problem with that a little while back. You think they kill a cop and the police just go away? Sen on Yi's in trouble if he is. I mean, in K, what do I care? But if I was you, I wouldn't let them see you do anything and walk away. This town is full of morons, Naz. It's up to me to put them into place. Yeah? Why? Punk by the name of Ace. Talking a lot of trash. Now the fool actually wants to race. No accounting for people's intelligence these days. You gonna take him out? Uh-huh. Motherfucker won't know what hit him. Tell people he's gonna take me down? What? Don't worry. He races me, then we scrape him off the pavement in sticky little pieces. Looks like you have little choice, huh? Inspector, it's Way. Hotshot's gonna race Ace. And he's talking like he's not gonna let Ace make it to the finish line alive. Do you know where and when? Not yet. Hey, one other thing. Hotshot and his friend Nas suspect I'm a cop. Nas Singh, the drug smuggler? You know him? Yeah, I know him. He's an informant for HKPD. He's the one that put us on to Hotshot in the first place. <laughs> Fucking guys playing both sides of the game. You want me to tell him to shut up? No! I agreed to help you, Inspector, but not if it gets me killed. Do everything you can to keep my cover intact. I'll deal with Nas myself. All right, Wei, all right. For now, let me know if you find out anything about that race. This guy wants in? He's gonna have to show me some blood on his hands. You show your true colors tonight, brother. You are an officer of the law. Who's he talking to? It's the Dai Lo, man. It's the chairman. Wait, you're coming with me. Looks like you're gonna meet Uncle Po. The rest of you, wait here. Don't do anything until you hear from me. What's going on? You are staying here like I told you. And you are shutting the fuck up! Got it? Yeah, boss. Of course. Good! Let's go. Would you like some ice cream? Mm. It's delicious! Come on, don't kill us in a fucking car accident! Yeah. You pissed off the wrong people. At least we kept Siwa alive. Yeah, that may be just what saves us. I'm gonna bump Uncle Poe's cut. Oh, and that doesn't. It. It's not fair, you know? Look what I built. The night market. All of North Point, really. And Dog Eyes gets greedy. 
What was I supposed to do, huh, Lee? I mean, what's hang up? Just what you did. Look, you can't back down from that asshole. You and him got history, huh? Well, me too. Listen, Wayne. Anything, anything happens to me, you look after our people, okay? We're a family. We're a family. Family has to stick together. Duke, Conroy, they're good guys. But they're not gonna be leaders. I know Conroy gives you shit, but you've proven yourself now. And they'll see it. Neither of you doesn't want to admit it. Do me a favor. Look after Peggy and my mom, too. This can be rough business. But one thing we got going for us is each other. Brothers. I know people use that word. But it means something to me. And it should to you, too. Not just that we're a son on you. True brothers. Blood. We look after each other. And we look after the people we love. Okay, Winston. See why told me he really works for Big Smiley, not Dog Eyes. I keep hearing his name. Big Smiley is backing Dog Eyes, sure. That's where he gets the balls to come after me. Lee has a lot of power. Along with drugs, he's into prostitution, porn. He even sells women across the border into the rest of Asia. The whole thing is run like an industry. Very sleazy, but big money. Winston, we can't just walk in there. Not if it's as bad as you say. We don't have a lot of choice. That's the way it's done, Way. Besides, you can't hide from Uncle Poe. If he wants you dead, you're dead. And I'd rather see it coming, you know? You should be okay. But if I get my ass shot, do not do anything stupid, you hear me? Okay. Who gives a shit? Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, Winston. What's wrong? You look a little pale, man. That dog guy tells me you've been throwing your weight around. What happened? You guys used to be tight as shit. Is he here? Nah, he left a while ago. Without a scratch. Doesn't bode so well for the other parties involved. Go right in. Have fun. Uncle Poe. Ah, Winston. Come in. Sit down. Have some tea. And you, young man, must be way. Winston speaks very highly of you. Winston has been a good friend to me. I've tried to do right by him. I like the way you think. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Used to be more common. Winston says you're the one who made sure Siwa was not arrested. No, it was Winston's idea. He had to assert himself, assert his position. But he didn't want to inconvenience you in the process. Did he now? In any case, you did well. I want to show you my gratitude. Uncle Poe, there's really no need. Don't argue with me. Do you know Roland Ho? He has a business collecting debts. The other day he told me that he could use some help. It's uh, quite lucrative, you know. <laughs> Tell him I sent you. Winston won't mind in the slightest, will you? Thank you, Uncle. Winston, 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 relax. I know you were provoked. God damn it. I bet a thousand bucks I was going to be carrying you out in a fucking body bag. Uncle Poe must like you. Uh, yeah, I don't think he has an opinion on me either way. All right. I tell you what, you get tired of spinning your wheels in the night market, give me a call. There's more to this business than strong arming street vendors. Ricky. Your name's Ricky, right? I appreciate the offer. You know, let me think about it and I'll get back to you. Take the car across the street. Give you a chance to see what it's like to be in the big time.
Yeah, you alright? Uh-huh. Things are gonna be okay. There's gonna be work to do. A lot of work. So stay ready. I always am. Look, uh, in the meantime, I'm getting swamped with this wedding crap. I mean, need your help on a couple of things. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I tell you, it's easier to be a Red Bull than a group. I'll stop by the restaurant when you're done there, okay? Got it. Hey, Roland Ho? Who's asking? My name's Wei Shen. Ah, Wei. You got friends in high places, my boy. I hear you and Winston have been making trouble with Dog Eyes. Dog Eyes has been asking for trouble. <laughs> I remember when I was like you. Always looking for a fight. Ready to kill anyone who so much as looked at me sideways. Here's a tip for you, kid. Don't take on a boss in your own triad. Unless you know for a fact someone else is gonna back you up. Hierarchy is the only thing anyone cares about. Always have, always will. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, old timer. So, uh, when can we get to work? Okay, big man. Petsy Wing. Bad luck at Mahjong. You'll need this. Collect what she owes. Hey, Jackie. Ah, uh, just checking in, man. I heard things were kind of, uh, intense. Wanted to make sure you're still with us, you know? Uncle Poe seems to have a handle on who's causing the trouble. <sighs> That's a relief. Look, I gotta go, Jackie. I gotta see a lady about some money. You're gonna pay up, you understand? <laughs> Shit, that's a lot of muscle. You old guy like rolling home money, you gotta pay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry! I don't care if you're sorry. I care if you have the money. I, I don't, I'm sorry! Hey, stop saying that. Sorry! Look. The car! Who has drugs in the back? That should cover my desk. Don't hurt me! I'm sorry! Damn. Wasn't gonna do anything that bad. Next best thing, though. Got a car loaded with dope. All right, I have to do. Bring it back here as soon as you can. Don't drive around in a stashed car any longer than you have to. Raymond. Shed. Finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I, uh, Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. That would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Wei. I am. Well, then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results, and you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond, I am doing what needs to be done. No, no you've crossed the line, Wei. I'm gonna terminate this operation. You can't do that. Pendrew won't allow it. Pendrew may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. 
But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Penju that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, you're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report, and maybe this time you'll actually read it. Yeah, he mentioned it the other day. Congratulations. <laughs> no problem at all, Mrs. Chu. Hello, Wei. Thanks for driving me around. Yeah, no problem. So, where are we going? The flower shop. I still have to pick the color I want. You won't believe how much work it is to get ready for a wedding. We've been planning for eight months now, and there's still so much to be done. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, it better be perfect. My wedding has to be perfect. So, Wei, do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> no, my life, it wouldn't be a good idea right now. Your life is why it'd be good. You have to have someone you can be soft with, too, Wei. It's very important. If you're hard all the time, one day you'll forget how to be soft. Then where will you be? <laughs> if you say so. I do say so. You are family now, Way. I have to look out for you, just like Winston. After the wedding, I'm gonna find someone for you. So how do you get on with Winston's mother? Uh, she's a handful. But, you know, her bark is worse than the light. That I know. How about her meat cleaver? Ha! That's worse than her bark for sure. No, she used to scare me, but then one day, I was having a problem with Winston. He wasn't paying enough attention to me, too distracted by work. And Mrs. Chu gave him a big lecture in front of the whole gang. I thought she might use that cleaver on him. Ever since then, Winston's been an absolute doll. And even though she still yells a lot, I know her heart is in the right place. Well, you're lucky, and my mother never liked my girlfriends. I guess it's hard for the moms. Well, I mean, you know, I used to have a thing for blondes, too. My car! My car! Bad enough if I went out with a Chinese-American girl, but, but a whitey? <laughs> well, it's good to know she was loyal to her people. No, she's loyal to her prejudices, more like. That, too? Uh, here we are. Welcome, welcome. I'm here to finalize the details of the flower arrangement. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm just the driver. I'm just gonna change back and then we'll be done. Uh, actually, there is one other thing. Black orchids. This probably sounds silly, but it was my mother's favorite flower. And now that she's gone, I was thinking that I'd love to have a black orchid centerpiece. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> there are none to be found in Hong Kong. Really? Well, I thought they had some down at the Garden Temple. Well, yes, but they're not for sale. The other day, the CEO of Old Boy Trading wanted one for his daughter. He told him they offered Temple $100,000. They still say no. <laughs> it's incredible, no? <laughs> A black orchid at a wedding guarantees that the couple stays together for the rest of their lives. Oh well, Wei, come on. We can go now. All right, next we need to pick up the wedding cake. So you got a cake picked out? Winston's in charge of that. He knows I'm very particular about cakes, but he promised I wouldn't be disappointed. I'm sure Winston will impress me. It's our wedding after all. 
And your wedding has to be perfect. Now you're getting it. So your mother took you to the States? <clears throat> yeah, you know, she loved Hong Kong, but she wanted to give me and my sister a change of scenery. Oh, were you being a bad little boy? <laughs> no, it, it was Mimi, my sister. Growing up in Old Prosperity, she... She started down a particular road and couldn't get off of it. And my mother hoped that moving to San Francisco would shake her up. Change who she hung out with, you know? Did it? Yeah, for a while. But some habits die hard, you know? Some don't die at all. I'm sorry, Wei. Winston mentioned that she passed away. I didn't mean to bring it up. No, it's okay, Peggy. You know, it's good to remember where you came from and where you're going. Isn't that a van from the wedding cake company? Hang on. What are you doing? Uh, yeah, the guy, the guy had the wrong address. Winston asked me to make sure the cake is delivered. He's so thoughtful. Wait, slow down. <sighs> Peggy, if we don't catch that van, you won't have your special cake at your wedding. What? Faster, faster, go faster. <sighs> He's not pulling over. You're a gangster, do something. Get out there and get him. Tell Winston I got the Wow, that's great. I'll take it right to him. All done. Oh, thank you, Way. Thank you. You know, it makes me think. Uh-oh. <laughs> the wedding just won't be perfect without that orchid. We're going to the temple, aren't we? I knew you'd understand. Do you have any family here at all? Uh, no, not anymore. Well, you're wrong, Way. You have family, you have us. Thanks. No, I mean it. I know Winston's work can be... rough, but it makes us family, too. Yeah, I appreciate it. Man needs brothers, uncles, and sisters, too. To help me with that soft side. Don't laugh, it's very important. You know, I could probably set you up if you want. <laughs> you're a good-looking man. <laughs> Thanks, but, but I'm not looking for anything serious right now. I wouldn't want it to reflect poorly on you. Ah, uh, uh-huh. You're still playing around, huh? Well, let me know if you ever change- Wait, what are you doing? Look out! I know some nice girls. Wait here, I'll be right back. What are you doing here? <clears throat> when it, when energy flows among flowers, we are all everywhere. Uh, I am here, and not here. I uh, love flowers. Ah, brother, so true, so true. You don't belong here. What is belonging, brother, when we're all part of the same cosmos? You! Stop right now!
You got them? Oh, wait, thank you so much. How can I say no? Hey, do you have any Winston's clothes in the back? <laughs> I don't think these robes are gonna make the right impression. What do you think about this? Yeah, sure. Cops, perfect. Hiya. Winston is not going to like this. Ah! Oh, thank you, Wei. Thank you. It was my pleasure. And if you're going to be my sister, the least I can do is help out with your wedding. Your mother would be proud of you. I hope so. Now, sometimes I wonder. No, I can see it. Life isn't perfect. It never is. But you have a good heart. Peggy, I... Nope. I know, women's intuition. It's the same with Winston. He talks tough, but underneath, he's a very caring man. That's why I love him. Thanks. That's the secret. You do what you have to do, but you always remember your family. Remember the people who love you. Then you'll always be happy. What's it like in America? Um, uh, less crowded? I guess. Do you like it better here or there? In some ways, I was more comfortable there, but it wasn't home. It's important to have a home. But I'm not sure. No Hong Kong. Home is home. Thanks for being so helpful, Wei. I really appreciate it. Of course. It. Sometimes this wedding thing stresses me out. There's so much to get right, and you only get one try. Don't worry, Peggy. It's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's so nice to find someone you can really rely on. I can see why Winston likes you. I found one of your statues. Tiger. Ah, oh, the tiger. Did you enjoy your time in the States? It was all right. To have two homes is to have two souls. So they say. And what if you never feel at home anywhere? Then I think you must guard your soul carefully, so as not to lose it. I found one of your statues. The sheep. This is good. Ever think about going back to the States? I mean. It didn't work the first time. Why would it again? And the past goes with you wherever you go. So you will confront the past rather than run from it. Damn straight. I wonder, is the past something we can defeat? Or is it something we simply come to terms with? See you again soon. Bye-bye. Hey, man. I'm stuck in traffic. I'll get there as soon as possible. Don't worry. There's still time. Don't start without me. I'm so happy you can make it. Congratulations. Peggy, you look stunning. <laughs> Thanks, Wei. <laughs> you both must be very happy. Yes. The best day of your life, <laughs> so they say. You know what? They're right. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so. Oh, Uncle Paul, welcome. Congratulations. My guest of honor. I'm happy to be here. It's nice to see someone who wants to be a good family man. Not enough of that nowadays. Hi. You look absolutely lovely, my dear. <laughs> Thank you. Almost as lovely as your mother in law. <laughs> oh, and this is true. I expect the food to be. Wait, wait. Fantastic. I got a case of the chairman's favorite wine in my car. I forgot to bring it in. Do you mind grabbing it and making sure they know it's for him? I'm going to make sure he gets inside, okay? Yeah, sure thing, Winston. You got to enjoy your day, okay? Where are you parked? Ah, right through there. I'm going, I'm going. Just bring it into the kitchen. Shit! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Jack, you there? Holy shit, did you see that? There's no way we're getting in through here. 
I'll find a way inside. I I'll go get help. Are you okay? Can you walk? What's going on? What happened to Winston? Okay, come on. We gotta get you out of here. Uncle Paul! You're hurt! It's nothing but a little scratch. You look sorta... Of... We gotta get you to a hospital. Doctor, now! What is this? What's going on here? My boy, maybe you'll want to leave before our friends, the police, show up. <laughs> Are you going to take care of my uncle? And if anything happens to him, I'm holding Hello, you personally police? responsible. Oh, thank God. Are we clear? Okay, okay. Where have you been? Stuck in traffic. It's Hong Kong. Fuck, Raymond. You think showing up for these things is easy for me? I know you've been through a lot, boy. More than we have any right to ask. Now the wedding. It was a massacre, Raymond. A massacre. Winston was a Red Pole, sure. But his wife? They fucking gunned down his wife on her wedding day. We knew you would become personally attached, Wei. It's inevitable in an operation like this. And seeing something like that would be hard. Hard for anyone. It's war now. No, it's not. You're a cop, all right? Your job is to enforce the law. You can't remember that? I'll pull you out right now. Pull me out? Your job was to get close to Winston. Now, that's not much of a strategy anymore. Get close to? Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston now. 
With him gone, I'll be taking his place. You want the chairman? I report to him now. You want the Red Pulse? I'm one of them. That's what worries me, Wei. You're one of them. You want to give up the best undercover HKPD has ever had? Your best shot taking down the sun on Yi? Exactly. We done? Yeah, we're done. Anything happens to me, you look after my people, okay? Get Peggy out of here. Winston! She doesn't. Where's this guy? Hotshot's trying to kill me! He's crazy! He's... Shit! You, okay? He ran us over in a bomb, man. Hey, look, I'm trying to find you. Hang on. You gotta keep talking. Stay on the line, okay? He's got crushed. What road were you on? Can you can you hear me? I'm just standing here. My feet are wet. It's his dead. Are you sure? Does he need an ambulance? He's gone. in there. Yes. Inspector, hotshot killed Ace. Damn it, Wei, we were supposed to catch them in the act. Yeah, well, they acted too fast. I have an eyewitness statement and all the evidence you need to get this bag of shit off the street. Ah! I'll type out a warrant. <laughs> Don't bother, I have a better idea. I'll challenge him to a race, and once we're in it, I'll lead him right to you. All right, but Wei, I want him alive.
Hot shot. Hey, say hi to the police for me. I was just stopping by to see if there was anything you needed. I, I know it's no consolation, but I got a look at one of the gunmen from the wedding. Now I will find him, and I'll make him tell me who's responsible. You Ricky, this way. Shit, way. How you holding up? I got a lot of loose ends to clean up. I need an outsider for a couple things. You got Johnny Ratface's number? Johnny Ratface? Man, stay away from that lunatic. You give him a job, you're gonna have to steam clean your conscience when he's done. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know all about him. He's my man. I guess you know what you're doing. Hey, is this, uh, is this Johnny? Yeah. Uh, a friend sent me to you. Works with a lot of movie stars, know what I mean? So? So I got a problem. He said you could help me. I'm busy. Wait, 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 please. Look, I trade diamonds down in Central. My partner took off with all our stock. And you know, by the time the cops look into it, he'll be halfway to Shanghai. I'll never get them back. Got you, fucker. You love it, baby. I promise. Are you insane? Think of all the money we'll make. This is our future, you and me. Fuck you, asshole. I'm not taking off my clothes for you or anyone else.
serve you some noodles. What? You crazy? Look, man, I got powerful friends. Eh? <laughs> Who would that be? They're gonna kill you. <laughs> Tell me their name, so we can go see them right now. Look, what are the odds they're gonna even admit they even know you? Fuck you, I'm not gonna tell you nothing! Yeah, you don't have to. Someone else will ask the questions. But well, fuck him too! Johnny the rat face. Meet Mrs. Chu. Winston's mother. Osama! I don't know what this guy told you! Fuck! I don't know what you're talking about, you crazy old bitch! Please! Wait, wait! Wait, wait! Don't leave me here! She's fucking crazy! Okay, okay! I'll tell you anything you want to know! Just please, don't! <coughs> 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 Shut the fuck up, Jackie! You gotta think! You gotta think! Don't be Shut up! Both of you! Winston's gone! Right now, we gotta stick together. We just can't let the 18K get away with this! What makes you so sure it was 18K? We all saw them! They were definitely 18K! Even stupid Jackie knows that! You ever think maybe they were just trying to look like 18K? Look, we've had a few skirmishes with them lately, but nothing major. It doesn't make sense that they would do something this big. Oh, oh, so, so, so who do you think it was? I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. <clears throat> and who the fuck are you? I'm here for Mr. Lee. I take it you've heard of Big Smiley. He's another son on ye boss, Red Bull, just like Winston. Okay, what can we do for Mr. Lee? He has decided that for the time being, you may continue your operations in this area. But the percentage previously paid to Winston will now go to Mr. Lee. That's an interesting proposition. But I have a counteroffer from Mr. Lee. I'd appreciate if you relay this back to him word for word. Can you do that? You tell Mr. Lee that his people stay the fuck out of our territory and in return, We'll let him live. I don't think you'll find that offer to his liking. I think you'll find that I don't give a fuck. You see our guest out, make sure he doesn't get lost. You'll regret this. I promised you that. Back off! I'll kill her, man! Oh, wait, I won't go! Oh, wait! wait.
Yeah. Don't let him get away, man. No way you get away, clean ponytail. No way. Tell your boss, stay the fuck out of my territory. Fuck you, eh? Just what I need. Miss Yang is a red pole, and she just saved your life. Miss Jang? Broken nose Jang? My apologies, Madame Red Pole. So why'd you bring me out here? I have heard a lot about you, Wei Shen. <laughs> I will get to the point. You must realize that you cannot stand against Big Smile Lee alone. That's what everyone tells me. Roland Ho said I'd need other bosses to support me. Indeed. Nah. I believe in harmony, balance, peace, and I don't mind spilling a little blood to achieve it. With Uncle Po in the hospital, there's much uncertainty in the Sun on Yi. If he recovers, we will both be stable and strong. But if he dies? The 18K presents a very real threat. We cannot afford to appear weak. We will need to elect a new chairman quickly. You, for instance. Ah, Big Smile Lee represents a step backwards for the Sun on Yi. Why continue to force girls into prostitution and pornography when there are other, less archaic, more profitable ways for us to make money? I have very different ideas about our future. I want to take the Sun on Yi forward. But it would be unwise even for me to stand against Big Smile Lee unaided. Which brings me to you. Nah, we both appear to have the same problem, Wei Shen. And the opportunity to benefit if we work together. So it seems. I have my own reasons for hating Big Smile Lee's operation. Now if you stand against him, you can count on me. Good. We will talk soon. Hey man. Wait! You won't believe what those assholes did! Who? Those guys are top glamour, they're fucking with me! I brought them another load of watches. They were supposed to give me two hundred thousand for them. Instead they give me this hunk of shit. I don't even know how to ride this thing. I had to push it here. Calm down. Give me the bike. I'll get you your money. What are you gonna do? Same thing I always do, Jackie. Nah, it's not this fucking guy. What do you want? My friend Jackie tells me you owe him some money. You're sitting on it. And where'd you get off strong-arming me, huh? I know you're a cop. And I know you're a snitch. You want to see who your boys kill first? Fuck you. Kill him! Kill him!
That's it, asshole. Come on, fuckers! Come on, be You're coming with me. Right now. So either you make him disappear or I. He's will. still alive! Don't any of you know how to shoot? I'll take care of it. Where he's going, he won't be in a position to tell anyone anything. <coughs> hey, I can hear you! <coughs> what the fuck are you doing out there? Open the fucking truck! What are you... <coughs> hey! Show the lady some respect! Wait, I have something for you. What is it? Dead triads. Six of them in the past few months. All found by the water. All sliced open. Well, what do the investigators think? <laughs> what investigators? You think HKPD puts a lot of effort into solving dead gangsters? Well, so what, they're not people now? This is why I'm coming to you. We just found three new bodies under the Aberdeen Bridge. Get down there and take a look around. And Wei, uniform officers on the scene say at least one of them is from your crew. What? You positive? Keep your head on straight, officer. And your eyes open. Who are you? Bomb squad. You here see anything suspicious, officer? What? No! Is there a bomb? Uh, you know, could go off at any minute. I'm guessing the blast won't go more than a few hundred meters. Uh, excuse me, I forgot something in my car. Someone did surgery on these guys. Everyone the same. This is no ordinary serial killer. Tank, it's way. What did you find out? Vincent. They got Vincent. I'm sorry. I know he was your friend. What are you gonna do next? All the victims were son on you. All had an organ removed, cut right out of them. You're right. This isn't just about murder. What's your next step? The removal looks professional. A surgeon of some kind. I'm gonna look into the hospital records. If somebody's stealing organs, they gotta be using them for something. All right. Keep me informed. Not right now. Another hit and run. Uh, poor guy got thrown right across the road. Uh, what's wrong with the drivers these days? I don't know. Seems like something going on. What, what are you doing here? I've never seen this many accidents. It's almost like someone is running down the court. You in the habit of challenging doctors, nurse? I'm saving lives. What are you doing here? So, so sorry, doctor. My apologies.
Looks like Dr. Sang is doing a lot of kidney transplants. Where are you getting your donor, Sang? on you guys just to get organs for an 18k ring. Tang, it's Wei. What have you found? I've got the doctor. He's doing a lot of transplants off the books, and he's got ties to an 18k red pole. I planted a bug in his office. You should be able to listen in on him. Tang, it's Wei. Stay on that wiretap. I expect Sang to be doing an emergency kidney transplant at any minute. He already got the call. But wait, they picked up the donor too. It's Calvin. Your friend, Calvin. Shit. I have to warn him. They're saying he's in Central. They're already after him. But wait, you can't let him see you. The only way you'd know he's in trouble is if you're a cop. <laughs> I got him. Pull in Dr. Sang. You sure? Tragic story of modern medicine, Inspector. Not every patient makes it. Way? I'm leaving this guy in the parking structure off Quark Street in Central. Make sure you send someone to let Calvin out of that trunk. Dr. Sang confessed. He's done more than 20 transplants for 18K in the past two years alone. The guy gives urban myths a bad name. He'll get 10 to 20 in maximum security. When you consider that all his victims were triads, I wonder how long he'll actually serve. 18K won't be happy, but I'll personally sleep a lot better knowing he's not out there. Doesn't bring back your friend, but I think it's fair to call it justice. I found one of your statues. A boar, an important part of the collection. How are you doing? I'm fine. But the past, I mean, your past. That's one of those questions you shouldn't ask. Is it? I guess those are the rules, but someone should ask it, even if you ask it of yourself. <laughs> what are you, a Zen master now? Of course. Didn't you know? <clears throat> uh, Mrs. Chu? Sammy? Dog eyes. Dog eyes did it. Is that what Johnny told you? Something out here, okay? Ew, they don't <laughs> they like that. Oh, shit. Move, move. <laughs> Come and get me, huh? You little boy. Shine like that. No, you flash a little dope and the panties disappear. 
track. Do it. Get down to the docks. I'm gonna need a pickup now. Got it. On my way. Done some bad things, Sammy. What did you call me? Huh? Nobody call me that anymore. This is about me balling your fucking sister, isn't it? Huh? You gotta be fucking kidding me, man. Wake up, little brother. It's not like I put that needle in her arm. You can't take this stuff personally, Way. It was business. You know what I'm saying? Not to me, it wasn't. Look, if you don't like it, you take it up with Big Smiley. He's the one who needs the pussy. I was doing my job. Oh, fuck, man. Is this what this is all about? Yeah. And Winston. And Peggy. Oh, fuck! You're coming with me. Look, maybe we can cut a deal. All right, stop all this shit, man. And I'll make sure that Big Smiley cuts you in on one of the side business. Maybe the fucking whole damn thing. I mean, hey, we can be generous, okay? Yeah, he's gonna be the future chairman of the fucking Summer on Ye! Yeah? You and Big Smile Lee are pretty close, huh? Yeah, we're tight, like motherfucking brothers! Me and Winston, we were tight too! <laughs> Get him! Get him now! <laughs> oh yeah, take your time, boys! <laughs> Where are we going? 
to the restaurant. What's going on? We're bringing him to Mrs. Chu. She has something she wants to tell him. Mrs. Chu, all right. We could take care of this ourselves. <laughs> Believe me, I'm tempted. But you and me handle this and it'll happen fast. This son of a bitch deserves the worst we can give him. You're the boss, Wei. Good driving there. Thanks, man. Oh, what? What the fuck you doing, huh? Wait, 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 wait! Sit down and shut the fuck up. Jesus, I haven't been here in fucking years. <laughs> Sammy,我已經給你一路開著個廚房,你看,我留埋啲骨在裡面,你中意嗎?係咪啊?It's <笑> 不是只是你一個人,有朋友Johnny,老鼠仔,他都在這裡。If you have a problem with me, then let's sort it out ourselves, okay? We don't need to bring her into this. Sorry, it's nothing personal, just business. Oh, God, I'm sorry, please, please, no, no, no! Tradition calls for us to select a temporary chairman. Until you are well, Uncle. A man who would continue as you would wish. If they were brazen enough to attack a wedding, we have to assume 18K will be coming after us. I know that you are right. Wait, my boy. Uncle, you're okay. Thanks to you. Sister Chang told me about the troubles between you and Big Smile Lee here. You must stop this fight at once. We must be united against our true enemies. Yes, of course, Uncle Po. Good. Pakmak, see to it that Wei is formally initiated. He's been a loyal foot soldier to the Sun Han Ji. It's time to make him a red pole. Your initiation is Young Leong. He has been selling to schoolgirls and was ordered to stop. He switched to the 18K instead. Make an example of him. Thank you. I will. If any of your people have not been properly initiated, bring them with you. Uncle, we still need to decide who will lead us. What about you, Pakmak? You are my greatest friend. You know my wishes better than anyone. Would you not take my place? No, Uncle. I, I am your advisor. I cannot lead in your place. So, if not you, who then? 
Chu Jin Sao. He is your true nephew, your blood, Legacy Doyan. Who better to preserve your wishes and keep the family together? Hmm. Chu Chen, can you handle this responsibility? Temporary chairman? Yes, Uncle. I am ready and grateful for the opportunity. Park Mark, see that it is done. Jackie, this way. Where are you? In the massage, man. Let me tell you, the girls here are... Listen, I got some news. <laughs> I'm on my way over. We got an errand to run. See you in a few minutes. Oh, all right. <laughs> Jackie, you're gonna love this. What's going on, Wei? Well, you're about to become a full member of the Sun On Yi. Well, fuck me! Are you sure? <laughs> 100%. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Yeah! Oh, don't worry about it, my man. It'll be your turn soon. Jackie, they're making me a red pole. What? Holy shit, Wade! Holy fucking shit! Well, Jackie, the dream finally comes true. No shit! Hey, Wade, don't think I don't appreciate it. I know it wouldn't have been possible without you. No problem, Jackie. Man, you want to get a massage before we go? My treat. Come on, man. Best way to celebrate. You won't believe what these girls can do. Then you said that if I stop my panties and mouth, pay me extra. So what did you do? I put them in there, no? Hey, we big dog. Them. Want to play with this kitty cat? So what's you the problem? Sell. Come on. I Every time he asks me for something, for I put the price up. Once he had my nasty little undies in there, he couldn't talk, huh? <laughs> so he couldn't order more? <laughs> So, what's this errand? It's part of our initiation. You know this guy? Holy shit! The oldest one of us, Wei. Came up with no prosperity, just like you and me. He's been dealing a kid. They ordered him to stop a couple of times. Okay. Did they tell you much about the ceremony? Just that we're in it. Brothers after that. Man, son on ye, brothers. Yeah. Hey. What? I went out with you, Wei, the other day. Finally asked her out, huh? How'd it go? Man, I made her laugh so hard. I read that somewhere. That if you make a girl laugh, she'll fall in love with you. I think if you're funny, she'll fall for it. Same thing, isn't it? So she looks up at me with a big puppy eyes and says, Daddy, little Gina will do anything for it. Hey, where's Young? Hey, I need to talk to you. Uncle Poe sent us. Let's go, come on, let's move! You okay? I don't know, man. I've never... Shit, wait, I've never done that before. I know, I know. What was it? I don't know, my my hands are shaking, man. Look, take a breath, Jackie. Breathe, man. Did you see the look in the guy's eyes? I didn't expect it to be like that. I always, I always thought about how it looked. I didn't know how it made me feel, you know? I didn't feel it in my stomach. Shit, wait. Calm down, look. It'll wear off, okay? Is it done? It's done. Good, good. Brothers, from today forward, your lives will be forever changed. Because today you are my brothers. We're bound to each other by blood, sworn to protect each other to the death if necessary. With our brotherhood, comes duty, 
You will obey our leader in all things, and you will show your brothers respect always. With our brotherhood comes power. The sun on Yi does not die. The sun on Yi does not forget. It rewards its sons with wealth, status, and honor. It protects their businesses and their families. It cares for their children as if they were their own. Our brotherhood pays our enemies with pain, suffering, and death. And none suffers more than a traitor. Betray your brothers, and you will die a thousand times over, slowly, in the dark. The sun on Yi and the gods themselves will burn your soul from your body and crush the ashes with our heels. There are 32 oaths. With them, you are bound together. With them, you become sun on Yi. Are you ready to begin? I read your report. I'm flattered. Was it a slow day or something? Pendra's very impressed. I'm not gonna lie, I'm sort of impressed too. He wants you to dig around, see what you can find on Sunny Woe, says it's a priority. I read about him. I mean, he reps entertainers, dabbles in porn with allegedly some human trafficking mixed in. Well, why go after him? He's not Sun On Yi. To bring down the Sun On Yi, we have to take down the people who support them, cut off the revenue sources, dismantle the network. This is how we hit him where it hurts. Sunny's revenue stream is massive, and a lot of it flows to Sun On Yi. I'll see what I can do, Raymond. By the way, you hear anything about Dog Eyes? He seems to have disappeared. Haven't heard a thing. Oh, and before I forget, Jackie Ma, we're taking him in. Jackie? From what I read in your reports, he'll be a good source of info, and it won't be hard to make him talk. We'll need you to set him up no, for no, us. No, that, that makes no sense. He's nobody. He's a criminal, way. You're a cop. I hate to be a broken record, but it sounds like you're getting attached. I'm not getting attached. I'm just... I'm not a fucking idiot, okay? He's part of my cover. He brought me in. He's the one who vouched for me. And now you're so high up, you don't need him. He's outlived his usefulness, so we're bringing him in. I'm taking this up with Pendra. This came from Pendra. Taking him in accomplishes nothing, and it makes my job harder. I'm not doing it. You don't have a choice, all right? It's a direct order. Yeah? Direct order? Well, that's an order you can shove directly up your ass, Raymond. We want the Red Bulls, the lieutenants like Winston. Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston now. That's what worries me, Way. You're one of them. Jackie, how's it going? Way, man, good thing you called, man. I, I got something, man. This could be big for us. You still got that plan you were talking about? Yeah. You in? We could go tonight. Drop on my place and I'll tell you all about it. Oh, bring a car, okay? Mine's in the shop. Hey, Jackie. Let's head to Kennedy Town. I'll explain on the way. So what's the plan? We're going down to the shipyard. 18K are bringing in a big shipment of jewelry. Goods from a big heist they pulled in the States. I guess they'll figure it'll be easy to sell here. I hear it's good stuff. Diamonds, rubies, could be a good payday. Yeah, it could be. Listen, you sure you want to do this? Maybe you should take a few days off. You don't look so good. Uh, I haven't been sleeping too well. This is that thing. Yeah? Every time I close my eyes, I see that guy. Not that he didn't deserve it, I guess. It's just... Man, I don't know. Sometimes I wake up and I have this bad feeling. It's, uh, I've never had that before. That's why I want this job. Low key, good payday. Oh, shit! So how's Jumei? She's good. She's good. Mm -hmm. I haven't talked to her in a while. Come on, Jackie. She was your dream girl. Yeah, I know. But maybe when we're done this job, I'll give her one of the pieces. <laughs> That's great, Jackie. You know, she'll love it. Just wait till it gets dark. Here, put this on. Yeah. Hey, wait. Do you ever think about what you want to do after this? After what? All this. I mean, we're not exactly cut out for anything else. 
Guess not. You always have options. Think so? I don't know, Way. I don't know if that's true. The jewels are in the van over there by the container. What if it's locked? No problem. There are heavy duty tools in the shed just over there. You get the tools, I'll scout the containers. Meet me there when you have some to the lock. Hey, who are you? Hey, keep your voice down. I'm sneaking into that warehouse up there and you're making way too much noise. If you shut the hell up, I'll have to slit your fucking throat. Oh, sorry. You won't hear me again. Jewels are in the van over there by the container. Okay, this thing should cut through anything. Is anyone around? Yeah, man, a couple of ATK guys. They're not armed, though. Let's go! Hey! <laughs> 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 Sure they're here? Yes, trust me, okay? What the way? They go get them, way, fuck them! Great work, man. We got him, Van Fokai. Wait, hold on, hold on, you're for out. What the? What the fuck you, you shit? Fuck, fuck, fuck! Help me, help me, way. <laughs> usual place. Fat wallet lamp shop. Let's go. Eh, I thought that was it for me. <laughs> I wouldn't leave you, Jackie. I know. Just damn way. No matter what happens, Jackie, I won't leave you behind. I'll always come back for you. Hey, thanks, Way. Wouldn't be here without you, man. I know it. I'll always appreciate it. I should be doing a better job getting you back. It's not your fault, Way. I'm, um, you know, thinking about a lot of things. Rethinking them, maybe. But not our friendship. The bad things that have happened, they're my responsibility. I know that. Shit, Jack. It's okay, Way. You don't gotta say anything. We're friends, man. We're friends. Don't move! You're under arrest! Where are the others? It's just me, boys. Just me. Andrew, you piece of shit. Save poke guy.
it down here. Jesus, Ricky, what's happening? It's the 18K. They're all over the damn place. They're trying to kill Uncle Poe. Shit. Uncle Paul. I don't know. Where the fuck is Uncle Paul? He's over there. Who's that asshole? You look so ugly. Hey, ugly. Tell me where Paul is. Shoot my face off. For some reason, I just don't see that happening. In case shut off the power, Uncle Poe is on life support. If we don't get backup power running right away, he won't make it. Okay, look, there's a control station down the hall. I'm on it. These guys are beginning to annoy me. Can we lock this place up? I'll take care of it. I got you covered. <laughs> I think we're clear. That was close. Nice work. No, man. We just got lucky. Where was our backup? Now, who's looking out for us? <sighs> Fuck. No one ever looks out for you in this town. I don't know, man. Feels like the game has changed. Used to be a brotherhood. It was a code. Even amongst rival triads. Now we're killing each other at weddings. Even in a fucking hospital. And for what? Let's get out of here. More cops. Get out, get out. We go. There's a lot of them. I'm beginning to dislike them. Glad you showed up, Way. I appreciate you calling me. So what's next? It's up to Uncle Poe. But I'm guessing war. Yeah, guess who? Those guys were 18K. I'm starting to wonder. A lot of people stand to benefit if Uncle Poe never leaves the hospital. He might walk out of there alive. I hope so. When the dog guys is gone, this shit keeps happening. It might be that someone is pulling strings, trying for a move that lands him in control of the triad. The 18K are getting out of hand. We have to send them a message. Damn straight. Look, I'll drop you here. Cops might be watching the place. Hey, Ricky, keep it tight. 
There aren't that many decent guys left in this gang. All right. All right. See you. Bye. Well, well, well. Look who decided to join us. Yeah, it's good to see you. Come on in. <laughs> you sure you don't want to fuck her a little before you start? It's no problem at all. I'll just have a swing by your hotel on the way to the studio. <laughs> nah, man, I'm good. But we could do a photo shoot or whatever and look. I'm sure it'd be fun and all, but that's not why I'm here, dude. Ah, you don't know what you're missing. This baby will fuck you in a way your wife never could. Sonny, this is Way. Way? The infamous Sonny Wo. <laughs> That's me. Infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This is King. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Way here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Way. Why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And with Wei, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you players, but business calls. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Let's hit the streets. Let's do it. Ricky. Listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie row of some sort. Hey, I think we'll start at the K-Bar. The VIP room should give us what we need. Hey, it's your town, man. So you producing for Sonny? Yeah, just this one time. And that guy's a piece of work. It's a fucking plan, you ask me. <laughs> I'm glad you said it first. Buddy does good business, makes everyone a lot of money. But as far as his personality goes, Huh? Good to know we're on the same page. Fact is, you know, I got some other business to discuss. But I don't think my partners back in the States would want to be in bed with that guy. What kind of business? I got friends. Guys I grew up with. They got a real good import and retail thing going. If they could use a good Hong Kong app, access to that good Asian product, you feel me? That's the reason I took the producing gig was I heard Vivian and her little bit of connections. Who well, they are? To me. Uh, well then, I guess this is gonna be like one of them old school business meetings. You know, when you show me around town and try to figure out if we're a good fit. Here we are, man. K bar. Good evening, gentlemen. We'd like the VIP karaoke room? It's right this way. Yo, hold on. And don't tell me you and me are gonna sing to each other. I mean, I'm here for the local flavor, but not that local. Let me find us the right kind of audience. Hey there, what's your name? Katushka! I'm Wei. So listen, I saw you looking at my friend, and I figured you realize he's a famous American celebrity. And I, and I just wanted to ask if you mind keeping it a secret. <laughs> Ooh, how can I say no? Well, if you're not doing anything, maybe I can buy you silence with a drink. Want to join us? <laughs> That's very nice of you. So you're from Russia? Yes. <laughs> How'd you guess? Ah, call it a hunch. Oh, you. <laughs> Here, have a seat. I'm gonna find a few more people to join us. Wow. Hello, ladies. Hey, Mr. VIP. Want to buy us girls a drink? <laughs> I don't know. My friend and I are gonna enjoy your company? Try us on and see what you get. <laughs> All right, why don't you join my friend in this? I'll be in in a second.
How about you and I go find ourselves a hotel? You okay, miss? Hey, poor guy! That's my girl, so why don't you fuck off? I'm son on ye, motherfucker. Now get out of here before I break every bone in your body. Oh uh, man, no, sorry. I didn't know who you were. The guy seemed like he was getting a little pushy. We get that a lot. You work here? Yes. So, you allowed to join the customers for a drink? Oh, that sounds nice. By the way, I'm Wei. I don't think I've seen you here before. I'm Iliana. Yeah, you yeah. I usually don't come to places like this. I'm here for my friend. Well, if you ever want to hang out at places not like this, let me know. I'd like that. Can I call you? Sounds good. Thanks. Give me a call sometime. Damn, way. <laughs> Who knew Hong Kong was full of such beautiful women? <laughs> Friendly, too. How do you not know Hong Kong has beautiful girls? You just had to come to the right place. Well, I expect you girls to make sure King never makes that mistake again. <laughs> you can count on us, baby. We love American men. <laughs> Don't we, Tina? All right, Wei. <laughs> Why don't you show us what you got? Come on, Wei. Let's see those lungs. <laughs> uh, I'll show you mine if you show me yours. That's it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, Wei. Hey, come get a picture of this, will you? Wei here has been promising me a taste of Hong Kong. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Yeah, bring it, baby. <laughs> Come on, let's bounce. And you know what? <laughs> you get good tourists, Wei. <laughs> That's my town. Least I can do. Yo, Wei. Don't think I'll forget that, man. Come on, my people will like you, huh? You got the right fare. <sighs> Too many motherfuckers think all you gotta do is jump bad and wear the right colors. Nah, business is a business. You feel me? You gotta be in it with the right people. Yeah, I can see you fitting right in in the States even. Yeah, if you ever want to change the scene. I'll keep that in mind. There you are. I've been waiting for you a single time. Stand back. Stand back? You crazy? Uh, icing on the fucking cake. Uh, 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 Some nasty ass shit you got going on. Remind me not to fuck with you. Alright, so listen, man. I'm going back in a week or so. Alright? I'll tell my boys I got the man for it. Alright? They'll want to start slow, but I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. This could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas, too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up and kept it safe, yeah, he'd have a whole river of green to deal with. You feel me? Well, I could swing that for you. I still got contact stateside who could set up the other side of things. I mean, look at Sonny Wolf. Nah, man. Come on, that's what's good about it. Everybody's a fucking moron. You come in with muscle and money, and you too can call the shots. You got a point. All right, here you go. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well, then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> All right, man. Take care. Hello? Eliana? Yes, who is this? Uh, it's Wei. You gave me your number at K-Bar? I didn't expect you to actually call. Really? I'd like to hang out. You free? Yeah, I'm off work in a little while. Can you meet me at K-Bar? Yeah, sure. I'll see you there. See you.
Hello. You off work now? Yes, it's nice to have a break. Let's go back. Hey there. Hey, you heading out? Yeah, I'm going for a run. I like to work up a good sweat now and then. You? Well, you could talk me into it. <laughs> Follow me. Let's see if you can keep up. Wow, you can really run. I have to keep in shape. <laughs> yeah, me too. Wait, you do this for fun? Yes. Well, what else do you do for fun? Are you coming on to me? Yeah. Is that okay? Yes, it's fine. I like it. Wait, let me show you something. <laughs> really? I've been thinking about this for a while. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind you fucking her. It's one of the perks. But she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in. Have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Way do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Way? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. Nah, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Who are you? I'm Way. Ricky sent me. Didn't he tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi, it's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speeds? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Uh, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? What's the deal, Way? You a gangster like Ricky? He's not a gangster, don't say that. Let's say I'm as much of a gangster as Ricky. Oh, that's too bad. Recently I've wanted to date a gangster. Well, maybe I'll see if I can find one for you. That would be nice. What's Ricky doing anyways? Why is he too busy? I don't know. Something with Sonny. Sonny? That guy's a creep and a perv. Sorry, baby. It's okay. What? What'd he do? Nothing. But he tried. I was at a party on Wallace Chung's yacht. I was like, 16. I got so high. <laughs> Great party. Anyways, Sonny was there. He was all, impress me and maybe I'll make you a star. He wanted me to fuck this old guy he was with. And that's him, that's him, pull up. Hi, Alex. How are you? Huh. This is your new boyfriend? Not yet. Why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey, so Sandra says you like to race. How about it? 
Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Wait. I'm not sure how much that's worth. Okay. We race for the girls and a hundred thousand. Sure. I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex. Because you're gonna need it. Think of it as your head start. I'll show him. This is gonna be great! Alright, alright, alright. Vivian and I will talk. <laughs> Steady hands. Gotta give you that. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, get a room, you two. Oh, shit! The police! Oh, cops. Perfect. The police! The police! Are they after us? Oh, no. Don't worry. It'll be fine. Wait, wait. Yeah, it'll be fine. Don't worry. Work away. You're driving us home, right? Of course. Well, unless Sandra has some other exciting plan. <laughs> I'm all excited out. But you can take me for a drive anytime. Wow, I just take you up on that. Oh, get it, you too. I think that's a that's a bit late. Oh, you are a confident bastard. I like that. Oh, that's it, just over there. That was fun, Way. <laughs> Thanks. Anytime. Vivi, give Way my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. <laughs> Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. Sandra? It's way. Ah, took you long enough to call. <laughs> well, sometimes you have to wait for good things. Waiting isn't my strong point. So, you taking me driving? Yeah, I'll come pick you up. I'd like that. Cool. I'll be there soon. Ciao. Way! Over here! <laughs> so, uh, where do you want to go? I don't care. As long as we get there fast. Come on, speed up a little. Good! Now let's go faster. <laughs> this car can go faster than this, right? <laughs> this car can go faster than this, right? Oh, hang on, I gotta check this. I just got a text from my dad. I have to go meet him. Can you drive me home? Tell me, Way. Have you ever had sex in a car? <laughs> I grew up in California. What do you think? Oh, well, I'll take that as a yes. Well, what about you? Is that your thing? Oh, no, I don't like that. <laughs> it's much too cramped, especially in a car like this. Limos are okay, though. Okay, then. <laughs> no need to get the door for me. Thanks for the ride. It was very exciting. I like exciting rides. 
Sandra, hang on, hold on. Come over here. You are such a bad, bad boy. Well, it's Eliana. I need your help. Yeah, sure. What's going on? My friend Katushka, she's gone missing. Nobody's seen her in a week. Katushka doesn't have a visa. She's... she's illegal. Girls like her go missing all the time, but usually they don't have anywhere to go for help. I'll take it out. Would you? Oh, thank you. How am I supposed to do my job when you keep stonewalling me at every fucking turn? Fine, sir. I, I understand. I just... I'll, I'll figure it out. Everything all right? These fucking politicians. They, they want me to clean up the streets, but they won't give me the resources I need to do it. I got something for you, and I'm all you need to close yeah, it. Yeah, well, it better be good. I'm in a pretty shitty mood right now, I'm not gonna lie. Kidnapping down at the K-Bar. Russian hostess. Probably here illegally. Now, I'm gonna investigate it further, but I wanted to give you the heads up. You know, I keep waiting for the other shoe to drop with you, but... You've really helped us out a lot lately. Let me know what you find. Have you found out anything? Not yet. Did Katushka have any favorite clients? Guys I'd like to particularly. Or anything like that. You should talk to Mr. Chen. He had a real thing for her. I think they were, um... How do you say it? Uh, special friends. <laughs> Chan? It's Mr. Chan to you. What do you want? I got a couple questions about Katuska. Why the hell would I tell you anything? My name's Wei Shen. Maybe you heard of me. Those shits like you aren't usually so fast to insult the son on Yi. Wait, wait, Wei Shen. I'm so sorry, Mr. Shen. I didn't know. I have nothing but respect for that son on Yi. Please, I will help you any way I can. How do you know Katuska? We are friends. Friends? You fuck with me, Chan. Okay. Okay, we had an arrangement. I paid for her apartment, got her clothes, jewelry. She was appreciative. Have you seen her recently? No, not for a week at least. She hasn't returned my calls either. Where is this apartment? I'll give you the address. Anything else? She asked me to get her papers, a visa, but I do not know how to get papers. I cannot marry her. I got a wife already, you know? Phone number for me. Five 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 zero one five one four. I'll call you back. Wait, you might have found your man. The number belongs to Yarkwai Lai, Fisherman Lai. He's affiliated with 18K. Runs a number of businesses along the waterfront. We think he's heavily into their smuggling operation. Know where I can find him? He likes to gamble. Frequents a little place in Central. I'll text you the address in his mugshot. Good. Maybe I can plan a bug on him, see where he takes the girls. How are you gonna do that? I'm gonna lose it to him. Have poker. Good evening, sir. How you doing? Hey, so how does a man get to the highest stakes table? You talk to me. <laughs> I'm feeling especially lucky today. You're always welcome here. Excuse me, miss. Where can I find the high stakes table? Just over there. That's Mr. Yard's domain. This is weak team, motherfuckers! <laughs> weak team! Ladies ready to lose your money? What? Who are you? I don't know you. Get lost. Mr. Ya, is it? Is that the way you talk to Sun On Yi? I don't care about no Sun On Yi. Only money talks at this table. Well, let's get the conversation going. Have a seat. I enjoy watching people lose. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make it interesting. What are you better against a hot Russian blonde? A blonde? Yeah. Got this girl over at K-Bar. Very hot. 
And she's, uh, you might say, in my debt. You win this hand, I deliver her to you. Are you crazy? You want a better girl? What am I going to do with her if I win her? And she's illegal, no papers. You can do anything you want with her. Oh, yeah? All right, brother. K-Bar has the hottest girls in the city, and I could use another blonde. Besides, I'm feeling lucky. Too bad for you. Bring the girl to the docks at Central. Come play again. Maybe next time I win twins. Liana, it's way. Did you find her? Not yet, but I found a man who may have her. And what are you going to do next? I arranged for him to take another girl. I'll follow him and see if he leads us to Katushka. That other girl, you're talking about me, aren't you? Yes. You ready? Yes. Now I'm gonna put a tracking device on you. I should be able to follow you wherever you go. Okay. You nervous? A little. Look, I'll be behind you the whole way. Thanks, Wei. I really appreciate the help. I know Katushka will too. Nobody else there looks out for girls like us. It's good to know we have you on our side. sort out that immigration problem. Oh yeah, we'll sort that out. Come on, honey. Get you out of here, all right? Relax. Yeah, we're okay. Can you get us out of here? Maybe. Give me a second. You're not 
like the others, Wei. There's something about you. You better keep a low profile for a while. Wei is the most decent gangster I know. I told you he would save us. We snatched up Fisherman Lai and his entire gang. Plus 22 women they were holding in two other locations. This is one of those cases nobody was paying attention to. If you hadn't cracked it, every one of those girls would have been forced into prostitution. Or worse. You've made a real difference, Officer Shen. Thanks. That's the last file I have open. I won't need you again for a while. Keep safe, Wei. And good luck. I found one of your statues. A monkey. Thank you. Thank you for the statue. It seems as though they're all finding their way back to me. Perhaps that was their destiny from the start. What does that make me? Oh, I have no doubt your return to Hong Kong will affect many destinies. Not least your own. Yeah? Surely. That's why you came in the first place. Maybe I just wanted to move back. Maybe. And maybe I decided to break my own rule and train a known triad for no reason whatsoever. But I think we both know different. Ah, way! Funning, funning, funning. Kind of you to join me. You care for some tea? I like yum tea. Ta. Thank you. Tu Jin Sao seems to be getting very comfortable in his new position as temporary chairman. Too comfortable. I hear that he is already planning to make it permanent, should Uncle Po not recover. Um, Big Smiley will kill him before he'll let that happen. Indeed. And that would allow Lee to take over the Sun on Yi himself. But that can't happen. No, it cannot. Tu Jin must go. Dan Hai, he must not be removed by force. He must step down on his own, after which there will be an election. Why would he step down? Tu Jin likes heroin. So far, he has managed to control his habit. Dan Hai, anyone who indulges as he does, lives permanently on the brink of an abyss. Nah. I've arranged for the quality of his supply to improve, and now he will give him a nudge over the edge. Okay. How? He is an immensely superstitious man. Ho Mai Sunga, obsessed with feng shui. He cannot bear to have the slightest thing out of place for fear of the misfortune it will bring. And you want me to... Make sure his luck turns bad. Very bad. I like your style. I will. Hey, what's your problem, kid? Mrs. Chang want you to talk to me. Hey, you broken noses guy? Mrs. Chang said you were gonna do some feng decoration. She told me to tag along. Give you feng shui advice. Feng shui ya! Ah. A lot of people live by it. Feng shui is huge in Hong Kong. You believe that? I've been spending a lot of time reading about those things to the natural. Want to make sure nobody I kill can hurt me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Goodbye, Mr. Chow. Have a nice day. Nah, right on schedule. We usually go gambling at this time. Two chin loses money fast. We better hurry up. Delivery for you? Really? My husband didn't tell me. He better not have ordered something stupid from the internet again. Wow. You got all kinds of skills, don't you, kid? Reminds me of myself when I was your age. That's salty. <laughs> I bet you smarter, but probably not as tough. Oh, I pulled a muscle deal. I had a muscle there. Ah, it hurts like hell. Maybe I'll get a massage after this. Hey, don't be creepy. What? You never heard of a grand massage? Like a real one, not a sex one. Happens all the time. Just as any professional athlete. <laughs> so, uh, how's business? To be honest, Tanya, pretty damn shitty. Really? What happened? 
gonna break from the import export gig. How come? Uh, something went wrong. I don't really want to talk about it. All right, suit yourself. What the hell do you think you're doing? The boss's dog got out. We don't find it before he comes back, and heads will roll. Oh shit! I haven't seen him. Open the gate from the inside. He'll fucking tell me to wait here. What are you doing here? Delivering Tu Chin's new package. You want to tell him you turned us away? Oh, sorry, sir. Carry on. Something else? <laughs> We're some pretty unoriginal ghosts. Okay. That thing there? It's supposed to bring good luck. If it disappears, well, that's not good luck. He really buys into this hocus pocus shit? Chill. Uh, can't blame the guy. <laughs> Two chins got more money than taste. At the time, 4.44 and unplug it. That'll freak him out. 4.44. <laughs> yeah, this could work. <laughs> oh, yeah. His phone's like yeah. fuck now. <laughs> Turn the piano so it faces the wrong way. I help, but I put my grand climbing over the wall. Hi la, my crotch isn't what it used to be. I'm at the law. Two chins gonna freak! Either he think ghost walking toward him, or he knows. <laughs> Somebody come <laughs> Mr. Chow, is that you? Anybody in there? What do we do? Just hide. Stay calm. Did they leave the gate open when they left? Anybody in there? Hey, is everything okay there? Looks like Mr. Tao forgot to close his gate again. I'm gonna get something to eat. You want anything? You ordering food from the Golden Koi soon? I'll be right down. They're gone. Come on. Keijia, Tu Chin loses his money fast. We better hurry up. Ayyatil! There's a camera! I hate how everyone got security cameras everywhere. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. So, uh, why do they call you old salty crab? Uh, 
Well, that was this restaurant guy who owed me money. Couldn't pay. He told me I could eat for free at his restaurant until he paid. That way, I wouldn't cut off his hand like I normally would. So a crab was the most expensive thing on the menu. I had that every night for about a year. Nina. So they used to call me Salty Crab after that. Then I got old. I'm old Salty Crab. Oh shit, I think he's home. Get down. All of a sudden, credit one year. Yeah. Those cards must have been rigged. I never had a game like that before. Never. What told me single governor? Why? Why did you stop me? It's your job to protect me, isn't it? Fucking rodents, all of you. What is this? You got all the Look at this. How can you let this happen? It's all gone to shit. Gone to shit. What do you want us to do, boss? Get out. Get out. I need to think. Chalaya. Wait. The guy left that car. His jacket. Ah, there was. I always wanted to get myself one of these. <laughs> one of these? <laughs> really? Ah, yeah, okay, bad idea. You're a strange guy, you salty crab. Thanks. That means a lot to me. Comes in. See you later, kid. Oh, salty style. <laughs> Hello. Wait. Oh, Miss Jane. How are you? Uncle Paul. He's dead. We're making arrangements for the funeral. Things could get uh complicated. Yes. I'll be in touch. Of course. Whatever you need. Way! How the date with Vivian go? You wanna be her new boyfriend? <laughs> Relax, Ricky. I'm just making a joke. So, Way. You know Fifi Miao? Uh, you mean the movie star? Yeah, I heard of her. What's she doing these days? She's doing another movie in the Stripper Assassin franchise. But I want the role for Vivian. That's a great idea. That would be huge for Vivian. Yeah, it would help her profile. Aren't you going with Vivian to the release party? Yeah, you're right. Good call. We're releasing the track that King produced tonight. You have a great time. You and the hottest star in Hong Kong. Go, have fun. You know Big Smile Lee? Oh yeah, we've crossed paths. Good. We've got a joint venture making porn. He brings the girls, I bring the production and distribution. That's good money, I bet. Yeah, if Vivian pisses me off, that's where she will end up. But there's more money if I keep her a star. I just have to make sure she doesn't flake out on me. I want you to put some cameras up in an apartment. I need it done right away. Can you organize that for me? Yeah, of course, Sonny. I'll take care of it for you. Okay. Here's the address. There's a box of stuff over by the elevator. Excuse me, sir. I don't think I've seen you before. I'm a location scout. Could you let me have a look around? Only residents and their guests are allowed, sir. I'll be quick. I'll make it worth your while. No. It's not gonna happen, sir. You have to leave the premises, sir.
Do you know who you are? <laughs> yeah, you should have seen me. We should get out of here soon. Oh, wow, that sounds nice. I'm doing a tour, but it'll be done in August. I guess you know what you're doing. Do you hear that? You look beyond beautiful tonight. Every time I looked at you, all I could think was, <laughs> I can't believe she's real. Oh, Ricky. She's too perfect to be real. Seriously. Every woman wanted to be you, and every guy wanted to. <laughs> well, you know. Oh, Ricky, you have such a one-track mind. Shit. Fucking sunny. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> you know I like that. Okay, <laughs> but let me go freshen up first. Whatever you want, baby. I'm gonna go have a smoke. Yeah, hey, Sonny. Nah, nah, everything went great. Yeah. Yeah, he was there. He was impressed. Yeah, you should have seen him. <laughs> exactly. Fucking second. And now that you mention it, maybe I should check up on her. Andrew, there you are. Are you fucking crazy? What the hell were you thinking of wrestling Jackie, huh? Oh, I thought we were past all that. I just wanted to congratulate you on that business with Tang. Good riddance. Now, what about Sonny Wo? Anything new there? What about Jackie, huh? Fuck, Penju! Are you deaf? No, Officer Shane, I'm not. But you clearly have forgotten who you're speaking to. Wei, forget about Jackie a moment. Whatever we can get to stick to Sonny Wo will obviously hurt Big Smile Lee. And we both want that. Fine. Sonny had me put up a hidden camera in Vivian Lou's bedroom. She and Ricky nearly caught me. He always did have a reputation for that sort of thing. Think you could get a copy of that? Are you fucking kidding me? She's got nothing to do with this shit. This could be the piece that we're missing on Sonny. Can you get it? All right. But I want Jackie in return. Cut him loose. Very well. Get me the video and he walks. I'll get it. All right, I have to go. Get me that video as soon as you can. All right, Penju, I hope you're happy. Vivian? What are you doing here? Well, Sonny says you've been really helpful to him and to me. And I just wanted to thank you. Vivian, no. Wait, wait. What's this about? N nothing. I just... I just can't... God, Sonny's gonna kill me. Wait, Sonny sent you here? Yeah, don't you know that... Know what? I, I just... I can't do it anymore. Sonny will just... Sonny will just have to get another girl. Look, Vivian, you don't need to. Not with me, okay? So, you mean you're okay with it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Wow, you're... You're the first guy who's ever... I mean... Thanks, Way. Way, did you bring the video? And Jackie? Done. This should be all I need to put Sonny Wo away for a long time. And with Uncle Poe dead... Wait, how'd you hear about that? Good news travels fast. I'll have Raymond arrange your debriefing. Congratulations, Wei. What are you saying? I'm saying it's over. You've done your job. It's time to come in. It's not over. Not yet. Wei, the son on Yi is seriously crippled. Your mission was an unbelievable success. I must admit, I thought you'd be happy. 
Big Smiley will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. I can't come in now. I'm not finished yet. I understand your personal reasons for doing this, your history with the Sun on Yi. This is why I selected you. But you've done more than enough. Those are my orders. Fuck your orders and fuck you too, Penju. I came on to take down the Sun on Yi, not to shuffle the deck. Shen, you're making a mistake. Way, the Sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Big Smiley will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. Shen, you're making a mistake. Fuck your orders. Fuck you too, Pedro. What do you want? Your friend Jackie. has agreed he'll be walking out of jail in a few minutes. Just thought you might want to be there to pick him up. Thanks. Don't mention it. Oh, Wei. Good to see you, man. Thanks for picking me up. <laughs> you joking? Of course I'm gonna pick you up. You're my boy. You okay, Jackie? They treat you all right in there? Yeah, I'm okay. I got lucky. Someone convinced Ming's brother to say it was alone. Was that you? Nah, I wish I thought of it, though. Some lady cop wanted me to turn snitch. Tang something or another. I told her she could go fuck herself. <laughs> Smooth. You heard about Uncle Poe, though, right? Yeah. When's the funeral? Soon. We should go get ready. Let's go. Eh, I can't go to a funeral like this. Like shit. I need a suit or something. All right, we'll pick something up. Hey, uh, so what's the deal with that cop? The lady. Huh. Said she wanted to help me turn my life around. So. Said if I started snitching, she'd help me out. Anyways, man, forget that bitch. These are the latest. Perfect for you. Elegant, but not too flashy. You know, I never thought I'd be able to afford a suit from a place like that. Sucks that I have to get it from post funeral. What the 18K doing here? They're here to make a show. Or maybe to start a fight. All the Sun Yi leaders are here in one place. I don't think they expected the police to be here, though. <laughs> Never been happy to see the cops before. Hey, where the fuck is Sunny? Yeah. 
Ivan Lenin, do you want? Then I'm fucking arresting him! Sonny Woe, I've been looking forward to this moment for a long time. Yes, and it will make you look so good to your bosses, they might even pat you on the head like an obedient dog. Right up until the time that I walk. Again. Not this time, Sonny. Come on. Don't get your fancy shoes all muddy. Let's go, boys. We got what we came for. We're leaving. Hey! You! You can't do this here! It's a fucking funeral! Goddamn police! Why don't you show some fucking respect, huh? Why don't you? The 18K are about to do this city a great public service. And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get. The cops are leaving? What the fuck? The 18 k are going to... This is going to get bloody. Come on. Shit, here they come, man. So these motherfuckers would have been to be sent on ye! Oh, shit! Flank them down. We can't let this go on. We have to deal with the 18K and with the police. Uh, we need a plan. Where's Tu Chin? He's in seclusion. Seclusion? He's in a hotel somewhere, riding the white tiger, that fat fuck! Perhaps you are right, Brother Lee. With Uncle Po gone, we now need a chairman who can lead us through this. Finally, you're making some sense, Chuck. I am the strongest. I am the most feared. I say I should be chairman. Perhaps temporarily. We should go Wait. with... Wait! We need to have a proper election. That is the way it has always been done. It's the sun on you, cold. Ha! You, a woman, talking of cold. You should never have been allowed to be sun on you. But I was, and my contribution to this organization have been significant. With respect, I have to agree with Sister Jay. We need to restore stability and order, and that means clear thinking. We should follow our tradition. Our tradition? You've only been on Sun Onyi for a short time. What do you know about our tradition? Nevertheless, Sister Jang and Brother Shen are correct. Fine. We'll have the fucking election. But I'm warning you here and now, making anyone other than me the chairman will be disastrous for Sun Onyi. Everyone has a vote. Our tradition allows- Fuck the tradition! Ricky! Out. Goddamn police! Why don't you show some fucking respect? Why don't you? And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get.
Steady now. Hey! Assholes! You! Leonido! This doesn't concern you! Kill him! Don't give me the harbor when you're done! Do you think it's over? Not yet. They have some weapons in the trunk. You better take them. Thanks. You better lay low. Wait, what's going on, man? Shit, they're Mrs. Chu's. They're coming after everything we got. Who do these fucks think they are? Big Smile Lee's coming after us. I guess he figures we can't vote against them if we're dead. Big Smile Lee? Yeah. You want out? No, I'm with you all the way, boss. We're with you, Wei. Just for once, I'd like to fight someone outside my own triad, though. Wait, up here! Come on, let's move! Move it, move it! Look out! Oh, Christ! About time you guys got here! Check it out. You stupid bitch! Where's Wei Shen? I got a message for him from Big Smile Lee. Oh yeah? Ha! <laughs> Just the piece of shit I'm looking for! You're going to vote for Lee, you hear me? You don't? We're gonna fuck you! All your ancestors and <laughs> These guys don't give He's up! Like, fuck! Jesus fucking Christ. Careful about guys. Big Smile Lee's side. How are you gonna bring him over? I got an idea. <sighs> Where the hell is Jackie? I don't know. I haven't seen him. Call him. No 
answer. Before you came around, I expect them to be hiding out somewhere. Now, I don't know. Well, you think they might have gone after him? They went for Mrs. Chu. Fuckers are going after everyone. Hey, Ricky. Whoa. Get easy, Rick. Hey. Look, yeah. look. We have to talk. I got nothing to say to you. Calm down, okay? Listen, Big Smiley's coming after anyone who's a threat. I work for Sonny Woe. We're Lee's biggest backers, and unlike you, I'm loyal to my friends. Sonny told me about you and Vivian. What? Ricky, I didn't do anything. I swear it. But... Sonny recorded a video of us together to blackmail me, and now the police have it. They're threatening to release it if I don't testify against Sonny. What do you think Lee will do to her when he hears? You said no. Of all the people Sonny told me to be with, Wei is the only one who said no. The only one. Even you, you didn't say no. Listen, Ricky, you have to choose. If you back Sonny, Lee will probably ask you to kill her yourself. Or you can get her out of here, keep her safe, and Sonny stays in jail. Okay, okay, okay but... What about Big Smile Lee? You let me worry about Lee. Listen up. You better keep a low profile for a while. Yeah, yeah. All right. See you. You got a lot of nerve after that shit Pendrew pulled at the funeral. What, he sent you to finish the job? Pedro doesn't know I'm here, all right? I'm completely violating protocol. Look, I never wanted you for this job because of what Dog Eyes did to your sister and how you handle things in San Francisco. But you've done better than anyone could have expected. I can only imagine the pressure you must have been under. <laughs> Don't get sappy on me now, Raymond. Wait, you crossed Pendrew. Right? He's cut you off. And this is your last chance to come in clean. What? Well, what's he gonna do, arrest me? Call me a rogue cop? <sighs> Look, I need you to be straight with me. Is he gonna blow my car? Look, I don't know what he'll do. Not anymore. Wait, just come back with me now. You're a good man. We can fix this. Smooth it over with Pendrick. Jackie, not now. I'm busy. Mr. Shen, we have your friend. So listen very carefully. You'll receive our instructions. Follow them if you want him to live. Look, it's Jackie. I need to go. Wait. Wait. Right there. Head him down, Liu Shoes. Try anything and your friend dies. Oh, he's clean. Where's Jackie? Go ahead. The man is down there. Where's Jackie? You're as dumb as you look. You know we're not letting you out of here!
Who does? D. White, Agent K's head enforcer. How do I get to him? I don't know. I only talk to him by phone. You tell me, and I might let you live, you stupid fucker. I only talk to him on my phone. Here, take it. Oh, she's far. I work for Horseface. I'm not talking to you. Put your boss on. He's dead. Shen killed him. What? Shen killed him. Plan didn't work. What? What plan? Who is this? I don't know anything about any plan. Horseface said if the... I hope you're not afraid of ghosts. I've come for you. Damn it! Salty, this is Way. I need a boat and I need a gun. Can you meet me in Kennedy Town? And Salty, make it a big gun, okay? I don't want to fuck around. Gunners in the boat ask me questions. I put a lot of ammo too. Thanks. You want a traveling companion? <laughs> Thanks, but this is personal. Your back. Fuck! Fuck! 
Doctor! How'd they get you? Man, it was Big Smile Lee, man. This guy fucking grabbed me at the fucking funeral. Toss me off the 18K, man. Yeah, they used you to get me to an ambush. Big Smile Lee. Fuck this work with the dog eyes, man. Fuck. Get him, Jack. Come to the lecture. Tell the others what happened. That'll be the end of me. Man, I don't want anything to do with any of this shit in your car. Sit on his knee, broken nose, Lee. I'm done with all that, man. You dream about me to the sit on his knee, you know? <laughs> what did you get me? Winston's dead. Piggy's dead. For this fucked up shit, I couldn't sleep now. I know what you're saying. <laughs> man, they buried me alive, man. I know. You don't know. You don't know what it's like to be down there in a fucking box. I'm out, man. I'm out. So what do you want to do now, Jackie? The election's tomorrow. We want to check out the building, make sure that Big Smile Lee isn't planning any surprises. But we got some time to kill. I don't know. I almost bought it today, man. For real. I think I'm just gonna go take a walk or something. Got some shit to think about. Sure, man. It's cool. I'll see you tomorrow or something. All right. I'll do anything stupid. Jackie! Jackie! What the fuck? Oh fuck! Oh my god! Jackie! Ah! Oh, fuck! Jackie! Ah! 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 Motherfucker! Ah! Shen, or should I say, Officer Shen. <laughs> My name is Mr. Tom. Perhaps you heard of me? Fuck you! I'm no cop! <laughs> Your friend Jackie didn't think so. He was most loyal. But then, I expect you wouldn't have told him anything. You must be a very dangerous man, Wei Shen. Son of a bitch, I'll kill you. Oh, save your energy, Mr. Shen. You'll need it. The last cup I had in this chair lasted almost 48 hours. Would you like to try for a new record? I understand your personal reasons for doing this. Your history with the Sun on Yi. You do what must be done. There were rumors. Before I'm done with you, you will confirm them. And then you will die. That's what worries me, Wei. You're one of them. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Zhang will be disgraced, and Big Smiley will be elected head of the Song Hong Yi. Call me when he comes around. There's no rush.
I suppose I should be impressed. You defeating my men like that. I am not. Now, where were we? I see you've cut your way through the amateurs. But now, amateur power is over. <laughs> now, your determination is impressive. Fuck you. Julia, you, you never win. Hear me? You never win, Wei. Fuck you. 
I'm gonna die, Lee. Uh, fuck you!
that your boss sold you out. And you fucked your way almost as bad as you fucked Jackie. You were supposed to die with Winston. Dog eyes blew that. And that poor guy Tong, huh? fucking worthless Lan Yong. But that's okay. Because I am gonna enjoy killing you myself. Fuck you. Oi, <laughs> 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 You want more? Is that all you got? Easy their way. This man is in my custody. Yes, sir. You okay? Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Where's Pendrew? He's up for promotion. Interpol. He's done with us. He's dirty, Raymond. He outed me to Big Smile Lee. Take it from me, Wei. Whatever you heard, it won't matter. The only voice they hear is Pendrew's. You did what you came here to do. All right? Let's get you cleaned up. Superintendent Pendrew, I'm surprised to see you. Uh, you're the one who chased my boys away? Poe, you know why I'm here. I can imagine all sorts of reasons. Uh, I'm sure you will tell me. I'm moving on to greener pastures, but not without taking care of some unfinished business with you and Sonny first. 
We had a deal, did we not, Pendril? I gave you the three tigers. It made your career. And I let you and Sonny continue operating. A sacrifice you were willing to make at the time. I'm putting Sonny away, and with you gone, I'll finish this once and for all. The only difference between you and me is... I know what I am. Jesus Christ. Pendrel, I've got you, you son of a bitch. What would you like me to say? Whatever I did, I made Hong Kong a better place. I served the greater good. But you... You let them get to you. You abandoned your duty, officer, and became one of them. You deserve to be handed over to Big Smile Lee. Did I? <laughs> well, Pendrew, I guess everyone gets what he deserves. Including you. You ready for life in prison? What? Because all your old buddies are going to be waiting for you. I made sure they found out what you did to Uncle Poe. That's a fucking death sentence. I know. Where you can't. I won't last a day in there. That's the plan. Inspector. Officer. I just wanted to say thanks. For what? It's me who should for be... For helping me close cases. Do something I could feel good about. Hell, for helping me stay sane. My pleasure. So, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. The job's over, but... I don't really have anywhere else to go. <laughs> Strange to say it after all that's happened, but... Hong Kong kind of feels like home. Yeah. But which Hong Kong, officer? And what about Wei Shen? He proved himself to be loyal to me, one way or the other. And isn't that what really matters? Leave him be. Yes, Anjie. Drive. Welcome, gentlemen, to Zodiac Island. You all know the rules. Over the next few days, you will compete in a series of battles. Your strength, your skill, and your courage will all be tested. 
Your audience are the richest and most powerful men in all of Asia. Each has paid one million dollars for the privilege of being here. They will wager far more on your performance. Do not disappoint them. You are the best of the best of the best. This is insane. No others could survive the challenges that my island will put before you. Even so, only one of you will emerge triumphant. Only one can be champion. Welcome to the qualifying round. Qualify. Get your bets in. best you can do. Welcome to the cliff's edge. The last man standing will move on. And only the last man standing. Uh, bring it on! Not bad. 
You piece of shit! This is the beach fight. Our competitor appears to be having trouble with his balance on the sand. You're not ready for the likes of me. Wait till you see my style. Try that kung fu shit on me! I dare you! My way today. Ah, uh, right. poison, you cheating bastards. Again. <laughs> How's your ground game, Shen? <laughs> Never ends, does it? <laughs> Takes more than that to beat me. Ain't <laughs> gonna be no next time for you. <laughs> uh, I'll beat all four of you. Huh? <laughs> Bastards tried that on me too. I wasn't dumb enough to drink it though. You tried, guys never learn. You're not supposed to say this, but I think the flowers will help you out. My Ma taught me about them years ago. Cure most poisons. Look for them in the rocks along the northern shoreline. Uh, 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 thanks. Thank you.
hallway. Get it together. will fight the armies of the island in a battle royale in the sacred temple of death. What's this? Wait! Ah, gentlemen, we have a fourth contestant. It would appear that Mr. Wei Shen has resisted the intervention of some of our gamblers. Best of luck to you, Mr. Shen. Take that one! Unfortunately for you, my audience demands that we determine a single winner. Uh, fuck you, we're not fighting each other. Yeah, no way! Oh, I think you are. You see the ceiling? It will continue to drop whether you fight or not. You can stand together and die. It will be most amusing to watch. Or you can fight. When only one of you is left standing, the ceiling will stop. Son of a bitch! Asshole. The roof is dropping! Those spikes are real! Shit, brothers! Alright, let's do this. Alright, well, let's agree. The winner kills that fucker. Agree. 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 I got no choice! They're not carrying me out of here! Propose to attack. Oh, shit! You are a fool to fight. Sorry, but I must kill you now. What the hell is that? I am dying! Master of the drunken star! You are no match for me! Oh! <laughs> 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 
specimen, Wei Shen. The best I have ever brought to my island. I'm glad you're impressed. You can take your happiness with you to the grave. Wait! You are proud, but you do not want to do that. I think I do. Good men died in that temple because of you. Your fans paid more than 10 million US dollars to watch you fight. I made twice that overseeing their betting on your performance. And twice that again by betting you'd win the final battle. Kill me, and all that money will rot in a bank account forever. Become my partner, and I will share it with you. Twenty-five million dollars, Wei Shen. A fair price for swallowing your pride, wouldn't you say? Good to see you, Wei. I got a call. Something about an urgent problem in the New Year celebrations? Yeah, about that. Uh, seems you made a lot of bosses unhappy lately, so... Are you serious? Look, I can't ignore a direct order just because I think it's wrong. Oh, come on. And neither can you. Wait, so, so I'm in purgatory now, is that it? Punishment for my sins? You upset a lot of people. Let's not even get into the property damage out there. Or the total carnage that seems to follow you everywhere you go. Bosses aren't happy. Screw them. I'm a cop. You gonna put me out on the street or not? In a manner of speaking. This sucks. Holy shit. Ah! Stop, police! Suspect is in a blue vehicle. License 12X448. 448 must be a rental. You seen a guy in yellow. You went that way. Seen a guy in a yellow shirt? I think he's there. Stop, police! In pursuit of suspect. Freeze! You can't stop us! Yeah. Uh, 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 u
Dispatch, I have a bomb here. I repeat, I have a bomb. Stand by, don't touch it. Wait for the bomb squad. Wait for the bomb squad. What? No time, dispatch. This thing's gonna go off. That's a direct order. Yeah, well, it's a stupid order. What's your position? The bomb squad can't find you. I'm running it into the bay. What? Are you crazy? This thing might blow up half the neighborhood! Officer Shen, where are you? Dispatch, this is Shen. Where's the car? At the bottom of the ocean. Negative dispatch. I need to follow up. You have an address on that license plate? Who ever heard of a plate with two fours in it? You got an address? Stand by. It's 322 Sa Ching Road, but the boss won't be happy. When are they ever? What is this place? What is this shit? This just gets weirder and weirder. These guys are fucking crazy. It's that cop! The fucker that followed Wu! Get him! Holy oh, shit! Looking at 10 years, minimum. I look at you, and I don't see a guy with the balls to do that kind of time. I won't do 10 days. None of us will. What's that mean? When the new year starts, it's all over. So your prisons, your laws, they don't mean anything to me. What's over? What happens on New Year's? The world, it ends. How do you mean ends? Master Chu teaches when the year of the state begins, the world will end. All of its creatures will be divided into two groups. Those who helped usher in the Great Reckoning will feast in heaven alongside the Great Master himself. The unbelievers will be cast down into hell. Let me get this straight. Where is this Master Chu now? I don't know. He's helping. 
We're all helping. How many helpers are there? Hundreds. We're his army. Son of a bitch. Look, I fixed you up. There's a group in Soho. We've learned that our guys are going to buy something from a dealer out there. Find out what he's selling. I'm on it. Hey, Daddy. How's my little girl? She's good. She's feeling nice and full. Enjoyed her lunch? <laughs> you know she did. She's really looking forward to her dinner. I'll bet. And her dessert. Oh, you're naughty, Daddy. You know I'm a little nervous about dessert. I like it where you are. Makes it more tasty. <laughs> is it going to be big? You know it is. <laughs> now I'm going to be scared all day. I won't be able to sit still. Seven of them. White, yellow, obviously. Give me one dark one, and one that's chocolate, and one that's really white. I mean, whiter than white, and a red one. You like kung fu? I'm Muay Thai. I'm old school. Got to be kung fu. Me too. All that wobbling knees around, I can't stand it. Maybe I date Franklin instead of you. See how you like it. You're a pig. You are always a pig. You're mean. Why do you have to be so mean? Where's who? The guy's waiting for us in the back. I don't know. But he's back there waiting for us. We should go talk to him. Not without who. I don't do nothing without food. But he's back there. He's just hanging around. Don't care. I want to wait for food. What if he doesn't wait for us? You the guy? Meet me outside. have you sold them? Just one. What do they want it for? They're gonna blow up the chain shot road. But it's full of people. Threats reported. Uploading coordinates now. 
Hey, Shen, you got a second? I could use your help. We got a bomb threat. I'm checking the vehicles. I thought there's anything to it. Who'd want to trash cars like these? <laughs> but better be safe than sorry. Holy shit! Must be remote controlled! I'll pick my bike! Get that car back! I don't even know what the damn thing looks like. Wait, there you are. Damn it. Fire! Fire! Evacuate! He's on to us! He has to die! Your world is going to end ahead of schedule! Road is now safe. I repeat, the Qingxia Road is clear. No problem. A bus has exploded in Central. I repeat, bombing in Central. Shen, get there immediately. Holy shit. You're here. What do you need? There was a bomb. Crazy bastards left a note. Said this was only the beginning. You need to track down the other buses on this route. HQ thinks they might be after all of them. What? Take that cruiser. Find them fast, yeah? I'm on it. What do you think you're doing? It's that cop! She's <clears throat> on to us! Crazy bastards. Come on, you bastards! <laughs> 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 Come on, you bastards. <laughs> <laughs> 
trucks came from the Aberdeen market. I'm gonna check it out. We're about to have thousands of tourists on the streets. You have to shut them down. Good luck. Proceed to the fish warehouse. Be careful. It's a reported gang hideout. Hey, that guy's a cop. Get him! Get him! Get the bottom out of here! We can't let the apocalypse get away from us! enough crazy for one day. I surrender. I surrender! If you got a lawyer, give him a call. Please, get me out of here. Those guys are fucking crazy. They grabbed me out of my chemical lab three weeks ago. They've been keeping me in a little cell, forcing me to make bombs for them. Oh, really? They threatened to pull out my eyes, cut off my fingers. You have to protect me. You don't know what these lunatics are capable of. Shut the fuck up. Dispatch, we've got a riot in progress in Soho. Please respond. I'm in Kennedy Town. What's up? Come by the mobile HQ for an equipment upgrade. Looks like you're going to need it. Wait, this is Dispatch. We've got a riot in progress in Soho. Please respond. I'm in Soho. They're all over town. We have crazies going after every parade out there. There's no time to arrest them. You have to disperse those parades. I'm on it. Hey, follow me. Please clear the streets! New Year's 
Cruise is canceled. We're in this space. Are you there? We have multiple reports of attacks. Multiple locations. It's chaos out there, officer. Track the cultists down. Do you hear me? You have to stop them. Face out. They've got nerve gas in a van. Stop them. There it is. That van. Careful, though. They've got nerve gas in the back. Here they come! Over there! Over there! Don't hit the van! Got you, you bastard! Take that, you punk! I'll take care of the van. You'd probably need it somewhere else. We need help here! Back up! I need more backup! Alright, I'm in Central. Be careful, he's got a whole army out there. Come on, let's go! You can't, you can't stop us! is on Lating Island. Take him out. Be careful. He's got a whole army out there. Is that your phone, Inspector? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I was aware of that. Our investigation is proceeding. No, sir. We don't know that yet. We don't know that either. Yes, sir. I... No, I... The minute I know anything, I'll... Superintendent, if I knew any of this, do you think I'd keep it from you? As soon as I can answer that, I will. certainly keep you apprised. You and me, Wei. Covering fire while she drives. I'm on it. Over there! You're mine.
the new year. The prophecy will be fulfilled. The end of the world. <laughs> oh, you're busted. It's over. You crazy bastard. It doesn't matter. I have done my part. My seat in heaven is assured. Look at that. It's just about midnight. Then our time here is done. Let's get him booked. No, let's wait a second. Three, two, one. You're under arrest, asshole. Happy New Year. Gyeong Si, terror of the Far East, tormented in the underworld for thousands of years, feeding on nothing but their hatred, their bitterness planning their revenge. When the gates of hell open, the Gyeongsi come forth, an undead army at their back and all of Hong Kong at their mercy. That was the worst movie of all time. <laughs> Who makes up this stuff? Hey, Wei. Niece. Don't make fun of the Gyeongsi. Night like this, they might be on their way. Oh. Uncle Salty has a thing for the supernatural. Don't Uncle Salty me. This is Hong Kong. Magic crawls through this town like maggots on month-old roadkill. Uh, Uncle? Well, you see any walking corpses, you give me a call. Yeah, give him a call, asshole. What the hell? The gates of hell are open. <laughs> and the sun on ye will pay for what they've done. Stop! Hey, stop! Don't let him get away! I'll try to head him off! <laughs> I heard you were fast! Get all you got, you son of a bitch! Hey, wait, get me out of this thing! Get me out of this thing! This is just the start! <laughs> I've waited 30 years for this! Let me down, damn it! Let me down! No demons taking me down. Hurry up, Wei, hurry up! Whatever you are, you're gonna die. They tell you, go see. I'm not gonna help you deep fight. Holy ass demons! You're not getting me to cry. Oh shit! There he goes again! Get him! Get him! What's going on? <laughs> you are not even close! Who the fuck is smiling cat? <laughs> Can't try it, you punk! Let's see if the dead guy can take a punch. Nice costume. 
Others. There's a, a big one. They call him S Smiley something. He was giving them instructions. Did he have a girl with him? Yes. He went that way. Probably used to playing with yourself by now. <laughs> Fuck! Stop fooling around and find food on the street. Hello. Come to the golden car right away. Okay. Okay. Where is everyone? Vincent? I, I thought you were dead. I am dead. And it's a drag, let me tell you. I've been craving noodles for I don't know how long. By the way, I, I think you've got a problem out back. What the hell is going on? I don't know. One minute I'm down there, the next I'm up here. So I thought, what the hell? Might as well grab some soup. You guys could leave an offering for a brother now and then, you know? Check out back. Tough as hell. Dead people are like that. He's supernatural, way. Gong si ma hei zhen hei ya. Now you're gonna need Chinese magic to beat him. Go see Hou Fa Wu. He's got the best magic tea in the city. Oh, are you shitting me? You just try to punch out an undead creature, huh? And you think I'm kidding? Teasing. <laughs>
What the hell? I'm a ghost. I can pretty much show up anywhere. You know what's going on? Sure. Smiley Cat is trying to take over. He's been talking about it down there since I got killed. Okay, who the fuck is Smiley Cat? I think he used to be in the Sun on Yi. From what I can tell, Uncle Poe had him whacked. Seems like he was out of control even when he was alive. Last I heard of it, he was going to enslave the 18K somehow. Then use them to take over our territory. Son of a bitch. Some magic? I got two for one sale today. Tanks here overrunning the city. No kidding. I'm how fat Lao, not how blind Lao. You want to defeat them, you're going to need my specialty. I need three ingredients. Ghost pepper, the egg of an albino hen, and antifreeze. The good stuff, not that crap they sell on the mainland. Be careful, Wei. The 18K are looking for this stuff too. I hear they're trying to make the tea themselves. How Smiley Cat got his nickname? Isn't it a cat food? <laughs> yeah. When he was alive, his street name was Big Scar Wu. Ponytail and a couple of the other guys killed him on Uncle Poe's orders. They hit him with a car, the knife in 42 times. They chopped up the body and put it through the grinder at the Smiley Cat processing plant. So Big Scar Wu ended up feeding house pets all over town. Ponytail didn't even put him into the high protein mix. So a lot of the cats just barbed him up afterwards. One of the enforcers who killed him got off the week later, and when he arrived down there, he told the story. So now everyone calls Wu, Smiley Cat. <laughs> that could be worse. They could have ground him up into fertilizer. Sorry, shop closed. I need the egg of an albino head, right away. Ah, you want to fight Chiang Shi? Okay, tell you what. See those kids? Punks keep tagging my storefront. Teach them a lesson, and the egg is yours. What do you want? Fuck <laughs> off, old man! Don't waste our time! You <laughs> Good work. Here's your egg. Make sure your brewmaster knows what he's doing. It can be dangerous if he doesn't treat it right. Damn it, Vincent. You gotta stop appearing like that. Sorry, Way. You scared the shit out of me. I said I was sorry. It's hard being dead, man. People didn't like me much when I was alive. But this is so much worse. Nobody lighting candles for me. Nobody making offerings. I never used to take that shit seriously. Turns out, it matters, man. It really matters. All right, all right, I'm sorry, okay? Yeah, it's not your fault. Hell, you're the first live person I've talked to who didn't run away screaming. Yeah, well, I'm in a car. Nowhere for me to go, is there? <laughs> yeah, that's right. You were always a smart one, way. What's 18K doing here? Get the egg into the goat dung right away. And I have the moldy rest blood waiting for the pepper. Give me a second to get the antifreeze ready. You trying to poison me? <laughs> Idiot. Most Chinese magic based on antifreeze. Trust me, this will work. Jiang Shi will be at your mercy. If you think maybe you're going blind, see a doctor. But only after defeating Jiang Shi. <laughs> Wait, you got your 
got any noodles? I could really go for some noodles. You get the tea? I got it. You sure to work. How can you even mask that? Whole fight is the best in the business. Yeah, well, if I go blind, I'm blaming you. I'll kill worse things than you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for me to return. Together, we will crush the sun on you and take over the city. All of Hong Kong will fear the name Big Scar Wu. Big Scar Wu, damn it! Big Scar. I'm gonna leave you to fight them alone. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, you drive. I got bad hands. Go ahead. Damn, sorry I doubted you, Salty. This demon really means business. Yeah, he's got a real hard on for the sun on you. That's for sure. What's his story? The way I hear it, they chopped up the body and fed it into the wagon over the smiling cat food. Man. Meow. You give a guy anything less than a proper burial, he's most likely coming back as a ghost. You turn him into cat food, that's pretty much guaranteed. Huh. So, what's with the nickname? I guess once he got down there, they changed his name. Maybe that's why he's so pissed off. One thing you ought to know, best way to fight the undead is with the peach whistle. You got me? Nope. The 18K Mike, they were gearing up before Smiley Cat got to Keep an eye out for them. Poor bastards. I hear they were looking for every supernatural weapon they could find. Looks like they didn't have your tea, though. I hate to think what be like fighting those things with no tea. Ah, shit. There they are. You coming? Take him out, where he go? Watch with that guy. Why don't we check out to kill these guys? Go for the weak side! You die here, Shen! Soon all of Hong Kong will be my slaves. We'll see how you like Smiley Cat then. 
than her, you shit! Nobody messes with Big Scar Woo and gets away with it! Never heard of him, smiley cat. Hell is full of Sun on Yi! Who better to destroy a triad than its own members? But then, you knew that already, didn't you, Officer Shen? Dog Eyes is around, Wei. He's even more obnoxious than he was before. Wei Shen! Double-crossing piece of shit! Now, you die! Kill this cop trash! I'll haunt every one of you bastards! Come get me, you worthless shitbag! I fucked your sister last night, Shen! She loved it. Burn with me, Shen! I'm gonna roast out your eyes, you fuck! <laughs> this is gonna be fun! Kill him, boys! I've dreamed of watching you die since they laid me in the ground! Hope you bought a coffin, you cop piece of shit! You can't touch me, Shen! What are you gonna do now? I should have had this power the first time! <laughs> down there. Those guys are pretty pissed at you, Wei. I had to hear it day and night. They won't rest until they've wrecked everything you built. I'm back, you little shits! You <laughs> oh!
always a coward, Johnny. Death hasn't changed that. You come back for me, or do they just get sick of you in hell? In hell? Johnny, let's you and me fight. you up and feed you to the fish. You'll be stuck here, Ponytail. Just another powerless hungry ghost. You shit, Shen. Or you tell me how to beat Smiley Cat. Then I'll send you back to where you belong. <laughs> Even in death, you break balls. Burn him. Burn the body. What body? You ground him up for cat food. <laughs> Most of him. Uncle Poe had me save Wu's pinky finger to guarantee he'd get no rest in the afterlife. Where is it now? It's in a red vase at the temple in North Point, where we used to swear in new members. Burn it, and you'll be able to send him back. I'll see you in hell, Wei Shen! It's about time you got here! This is what revenge looks like, Shen. I have a thousand years of dead soldiers at my command! Sun on Yi killed me once, they won't do it again! <laughs> Your sister waits for you in hell, Wei Shen. Come with me. Say hello. Alright? Is he gone? 
Not quite. No! Back to hell. That should be last to Smiley Cat. No! No! Enjoy it, old friend. Shall we finish that date? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 ha!